you raise one dollar, if you raise five thousand dollars, or if you raise millions of dollars, no matter the time, the duration, when you do it, who you are, or where you live, you are all part of the same team. Because the competition is not between us. The competition is between the people that are suffering and how much money we can raise. What up? 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 I'm actually just realizing I forgot a thing that I gotta grab here in a second, but it's all good because I'll take care of it later or in a little bit, something like that. Um, hey, what's up? Let me uh, let me do this guy. Do this one first. There we go. Good evening. Um, we're gonna play some magic here in a minute. Uh, but somebody in chat actually just brought it up, which is good. Uh, I'm glad that they did because I wanted to kind of talk about it a little bit. What deck did you build? We'll talk. Let's talk. Let's let's talk about this monstrosity that I just whipped together. I don't. <laughs> it's it's going to be interesting. Um, I have no idea if it's going to be good or not. <laughs> but we'll see, right? Well, fuck it. We'll see. Um, so a couple days ago, I talked about building a uh, Lara Croft Tomb Raider deck because uh, I have the secret layer cards. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, Mommy Lara. Uh, it's pretty cool. Uh, can I see the mox field? I'll sh I'm going to show it here in a second. It's not done because I have a build and then for every card that I'm missing or don't have multiple copies of, I sideboarded some stuff. I sideboarded 26 cards that are going to be swapped out eventually when I get the cards that go in place of it. So I wish to judge it. I don't need you to judge shit. I know it's going to be weird. Um, so I have no idea if it's going to be good or bad. Uh, but let's kind of... Here, let me um, let me pull it up. This dude, this thing's going to be real fucking wacky. Um, okay, so let me let me make it big. We can, we can go through this whole thing. Let me, can, I make it, can I make it bigger? Yeah, here we go. That's, yeah, there we go. Look at that. Uh, okay. So Lara Croft, obviously, uh, commander. Um, yeah, I, uh, we'll see. Uh, so whenever she attacks, I'm going to exile legendary artifacts or legendary lands from my graveyard, put a discovery counter on it, and then I can play them from exile. Um, I can play a card from exile uh, that has a discovery counter on it every turn, um, which means anything that dies, if it's a legendary artifact, if it's a legendary artifact, I can just bring it right back, which is sick. Um, Duretti is in there for sacking artifacts and um, doing the whole returning artifact thing, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, it's going to be interesting. Birds of Paradise, yeah, new card, Crime Novelist. Whenever you sack an artifact, he gets a 1-1 one, one, and I add, add red. Uh, Delighted Halfling is in there. All the ones that have blue checks are actually in there. Um, swap cam to not cover card text. Oh, it it's, looks like it's fine to me. It's literally right here, but... Yeah, I, th I think we're good. I I'll just read. Um, <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, Delighted Halfling for legendary spells, that kind of thing. Enthusiastic Mechanaut, uh, reducing costs, glowing to make treasures. Um, I'm just, just going to need them. Here's, here's my win con. This is like the one win con that's in here. Um, I should be able to get 20 artifacts. I should. And I'll show you why in a second. Um, K9 Mark 1 for giving legendary creatures ward, uh, as well as making things unblockable, which is great for my commander. Um, Solemn Simulacrum. Supply Llama is in here. Uh, <laughs> Ethereum Sculptor, which I'm super excited for. So he he, he made the cut. 
I brought Sir Ginger in. Trayable expert in haste on the opponent controls the planeswalker. We'll see. Whenever another artifact you control is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, he gets a well, plus one, plus one, and describe one. I don't know. It felt like a fit. So I fucking put him in there, dude. I will see. Uh, reality chip. Um, as long as it's attached to a creature, you play lands and cast spells from the top of your library. Perfect. Uh, I can reconfigure him. Uh, Urza, Lord High Artificer, made his, snuck his way in here. Uh, so I'll be making... Uh, do, I'll be doing some shit uh, with this. Um, we'll see. Uh, as far as sorceries go, the only one of the three that I wanted that I have is Farseek. So there's that. I didn't get Fabricate, which was literally to search for uh, an artifact card. Windfall. Since I don't have uh, Fabricate, I threw... Um, you'll see in a second, but Worldly Tutor is in here. Uh, Chaos Warp or Chaos Theory is in here. Um, because why not? Uh, demand Answers. I can discard an artifact. Uh, sack an artifact or discard a card uh, to draw two. Great. Fierce Guardianship. Broke Intervention. Some some straight up normal ones. Uh, Andril Flame of the West is in here. So I'm going to be making Spirits. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, Arcane Signet, uh, Brass Tunnel Grinder, Chamil for Discover, Discover 5 just every turn. Uh, Hammer for <coughs> for free attaching. I just play an equipment, it just goes just goes straight on there. Laura needs Academy Runes. Just fucking wait, brother. Okay, just wait. Just fucking shut up and wait. Lightning Greaves, uh, my Palantir is gonna make it, it's gonna show its face. Soul Ring, uh, Stone of Erect, so Anytime an opponent uh, creature dies, it just gets fucking exiled. <laughs> Swift of Boots, Terry Soul Cleaver, Ever Flowing Well, uh, Grim Whisper, which is a uh, Tomb Raider specific card. It's Bow of Nylea, which is really good fucking equipment for a deck like this. Uh, Immortal Sun for spell cost reduction, additional card draw, and creature plus one plus one. Uh, the Indomitable, there's a one ring in here because. Why not, dude? Uh, Todex Spear, which is just Shadow Spears in here. Rhystic Study and Heart of the Explorer, um, which should be a lot of fun. Uh, and then as far as lands go, pretty standard land base. Um, I was missing some. I don't have any spare exotic orchards right now. Don't know why. So the guy that mentioned um, fucking uh, the one... Th oh, there's Croft Manor, which is Command Tower. Um, the dude that mentioned... Oh, what is it? The fucking land that is... Uh, Academy, whatever the fuck that is. It's it's in here. Maybe I just didn't put it in the uh, list. Anyway, here's my sideboard temp cards. Ready? These are the ones that I didn't intend to put in here, but they're in here because fuck it. The battle bus is showing its face. <laughs> There's Fortnite cards in this bitch. I got Fortnite. I got uh, <laughs> I got fucking Tomb Raider. I got Jurassic Park shit in here, dude. Battle Royale. <laughs> Trample and infect? Dude, I could get, maybe Lara Croft can fucking battle royale and kill somebody. I don't know. Chromatic Lantern, uh, Dark Seal Monolith, so I can I can cast color spells from my hand. And the reason that that stuff is important, Riss, I am 100% memeing. Uh, Entish Restoration. Oh yeah, there's Lord of the Rings stuff in here too. This is, uh, this is multiple universes fucking collided. It's wild. Um, oh yeah, Ultimate Failure. This is for you, brother. Uh, I need this is a card. I need to go grab this guy. Uh, whenever you cast an artifact spell, investigate, which means I'm gonna make clue tokens, and those are artifacts. I need to go get this guy and put him in here. Uh, he's upstairs. Uh, gamble, uh, Godo for multiple combats, because why not? Uh, more land. I put, yeah, oh, oh, yeah. I put Karlak in here. Whenever you attack, you just get multiple combats again. <laughs> Dude. I don't know what the fuck's going on in here. Uh, like I said, I started getting crazy. It was like, fuck yeah, dude, let's go. That's going to be great. It's, they're just so weird. Um, Car and the Great Creator. So uh, up to one, uh, one target non-creature artifact becomes a creature with power and toughness equal to its mana value. That's going to be really important later. Uh, oh, yeah, here you go. Academy Runes is in there. Uh, put target artifact card from your graveyard on top of your library, of course, which is another Tomb Raider card. Uh, Matt Salanti, the great door, because why wouldn't I? Honestly, and then you just get 
colorless mana or uh, any mana of one color based on the number of permanents in my graveyard i've been doing a lot of that here's where shit gets wild okay mycosynth golem affinity for artifacts and then artifact creature spells get affinity for artifacts oh did i mention oh no i haven't gotten to him yet so that's in there but the whole thing mycosynth lattice here's the idea behind this deck if i can tutor lattice out and get all that shit going everything is artifacts which means every creature has affinity for artifacts which means every legendary can come back from the graveyard because of uh, Lara croft not just legendary artifact creatures because they're all going to be artifacts if lattice is out everything goes nuts this this card will make this shit go fucking crazy uh because i wanted the whole the whole trio uh microsynth wellspring fuck it why not um i threw in a sword of the animist get that out there uh i brought fucking planar bridge the cube search your library for a permanent card like microsynth lattice put it onto the battlefield and then shuffle shires in there despian stage yeah yeah cool uh whisper silk cloak great worldly tutor and then just because fuck it why not i put zula doc in there why not colorless spells dude michael synth lattice all per all cards spells and permanents are colorless which means everything is going to cascade every spell that's seven or more will have cascade cascade if lattice is out That doesn't make stuff the graveyard artifacts. The other microsynth thingy, the blue one. Are you sure? That literally says all cards that aren't on the battlefield, spells, and permanents are colorless. That's everything. Oh, well, it doesn't make. Uh, oh, I guess. Okay, never mind. I see what you're saying. Uh, the stuff in the graveyard won't be artifacts, but permanents are artifacts. Yeah, I got you. Yes. Um, either way, this is going to go fucking crazy. Um, this, this should be a ride. There's a ton of stuff that I want to swap out anyway, um, that I just don't have multiple copies of, but this is the, the general idea for this deck is, uh, it's going to be wacky, dude. I don't know what it's going to do. I have no idea. I'm pretty short on creatures. I'm, I'm, I think, um, I have a sideboard of cards, by the way, right here. There's some stuff in here that's not actually listed. So on my sideboard that I might swap out if we play a second game and I might go again, um, I've got the new Ral Zarek, uh, so I can tap other perm other people's permanents and untap my own. But then his bottom power is a, uh, uh, he's a um, planeswalker, is flip five coins for every heads I take another turn. Um, I don't have a Karn the Great Creator. Uh, he is, uh, oh no, I do, he's in the deck. Yeah, he's in there. Um, I have a subterranean schooner. Uh, hit the mother load is sideboarded. Bigger on the inside is sideboarded. Uh, Treasure Nabber, Cathartic Reunion, uh, Pariah Shield, and Sword of the Peru uh, Peruns. Uh, Magnetic Snuffler, which is a new one. When he ETBs, uh, return target equipment card from your graveyard to the battlefield and attach it to him. Whenever you sack a, an artifact, he gets a 1 1 counter. Uh, Hero's Blade, a sideboarded Cyber Ship. Because making oh yeah fuck there's there's a couple cards that aren't the, on this list, um, champion's helm, uh, Lothlorien Loth blade and then blade of selves, but then there's um, there's a couple other hold on let me see there's a couple other cards that are not listed on here yet that I had sideboarded that I just threw in at the last second uh, because I was like I need shit in here because I don't have a hundred cards um, got that one got that one. there's one in particular I want to uh, bring up so if all permanents are artifacts. Right? If I get that, if I get my Microsynth Lattice out, um, and then I play. Oh, where is he? Oh, I have uh, Blood Forge Battle Axe in here. It's uh, plus two plus zero equipment. And then whenever you deal combat damage to a player, I make a token copy of it. So I just get another Blood Forge Battle Axe. It could go to one to two to four. There's a Curiosity in here for card draw. Um, where the fuck is it? There's one in particular that I was like, I'm going to put this in here. And it oh, yeah. Cyberman Patrol. Artifact creatures you control have a flicked three. 
So I'm going to start punching through people when the time comes. I'm excited to see this this deck do fucking anything. It's going to be stupid. Um, so yeah, that's the plan for tonight. We'll see if I can get the win con going. Um, they have no idea what they're in for. Hi. Hello. Hello. How's it going? Good. Going good. How about you? Good. Um, are you playing Markov? Do I? Should I not? That's probably going to kick my ass. Okay. It, it will pro I'm going to be, like I said, so I don't know. I was just telling chat. I went through the whole deck list with chat. Um, I don't know what this deck can do. Uh, I would, so according to, you know that website I showed you a while ago, Amy, that like rates the, the decks or whatever? Yeah. It shows a six right now. Hmm. Uh, so I guess go around that. Gunny's playing Nelly Borka. What's Fuck. Gimbal? Okay. Wait, I don't know what. Oh, Nelly. Nelly's, oh, Nelly's no, gonna no, goad Nelly. stuff. She's, she's pretty strong. Well, I think we can, we can manage Should her. Should I Nyctia? Honestly, maybe Amy, you do Markov. I, I know, I know you're gonna kill me with Markov. I just want to see if this deck can do stuff. Is all. So like, you can play Markov. Just promise you don't pummel me into outer space. I guess. <laughs> I'll just try something different. That's just a really strong fucking deck. I think. Let's see. What does what does Gimbal do? Gimbal artifact creature control. Have, oh, you wait. Is that an artifact deck? Yeah. <laughs> Why? Because I'm playing an artifact deck too. Is that bad? No, that's fine. It, it's fine. Why do you say it? You made it sound like it's not fine. No, it's fine. I didn't make it sound like anything. I think you're you're. <laughs> I'm overthinking it. You are. Yeah, you are. Yes, you are. Um, th this is just pure vanilla pretty con too it's not like upgraded in any way yeah oh, she's, she's still, still very good. scary she's, I, I played her she's still good but that's cool okay um i need to run upstairs and grab one card that i uh missed and need to swap in it is a creature and then i will be ready to go whatever whatever when amy comes back whatever she wants to play she can play i it doesn't really matter i just don't want to I just want to see it do something, because otherwise it's like a giant fucking waste of time. I got you. I will be right back. Uh, Electra, you're in charge Miss of my you chat. Already. You're George. Hey, chat. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Listen, this is all on you. I'm, I'm not even here. Okay, well, you want to know? I'm, I'm a little, I'm a little out of it right now because I spent six hours, six hours playing Supermarket Simulator today, and I did not leave my chair once during the six hours. Okay. That game looks surprisingly addicting. <laughs> it is so much fun and it's so perfect because you you constantly have things to do at all times you always need to up your stock you always you're checking people you know out with their you skin in the little items and it's like perfect little asmr you go like doo, 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 and then they hand you your thing and then you like and, the cha -ching. Doo, 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 cha -ching. and then when you're buying things it also goes cha -ching. and then when you put stuff up it goes like foom, 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 foom. <laughs> Oh my god, it's it was, so it's so good. Oh yeah, but then um I have one employee, his name is Steve, and he is awful. He's so slow at checking people out. He'll scan an item and then look up at me and stare at me. And then like scan another item. Approval. Yeah, I'm like, okay, Steve, you're doing good. Just faster, please. <laughs> the comparison between like me checking people out, which it's like you can literally just click, 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 click. And he's like, beep. Beep. <laughs> like Steve, get it together. Damn it, Steve. <sighs> Is your shop under a union? If not, then you just fire Steve. Yeah, <laughs> it's true. Actually, you, I, uh, I hired him at first, and then I immediately fired him that day because he made me angry with how slow he was being. 
Um, <laughs> and then it got too much where I I had to uh, I I had to hire him back, so so I let him come back in. But I'm pretty sure after I hi after I fired him, he came back in a disguise to buy things. Like he definitely looked like one of the one of my shoppers. <laughs> So I think did he complain that something wasn't in stock and the price was too high? Yeah, he was like, you need to speak to your manager. I was like, I am the manager. Steve, is that you? No, no, I swear. My name's Reeve. Yeah, but anyway, Steve okay, is back. Reeve. Reeve. <laughs> if that's your real name. That's a made up name, Reeve. <laughs> Pulls out his ID. It's actually Reeve. Well, OK, then. <laughs> Sorry no, about literally. that. Do you know us, Steve? That's my evil cousin. We don't talk to him anymore. You hire Reeve and Reeve's actually a good employee? <laughs> yeah, probably. He'd be like, beep, 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 beep. He actually buys the store, hires me. I just live <laughs> as a cashier the rest of the time. No, but it actually was surprisingly very, 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 very fun. Hi, I'm back. Hi, back. Uh, Hello, which one do I play? I have rats. Castle, humans, and fairies. They're all kind of like the same range, I think. Upgraded pre-cons, except for the rat. Um, I would think I might be able to put up a fight against the humans or the fairies. Okay. That's okay. Ultimately, you can play whatever you want. I mean, it's, it's... I mean just play Markov. If you want to play Markov, <laughs> just play Markov. It's fine. Marky Mark and the, the Bitey Bunch. Whatever. Okay. Okay. Amy, who would you have the most fun playing? Yeah. Diada. But no. <laughs> That's your strongest deck. She's my third strongest. What? You, what do you think your strongest deck is? Omna. Um, nah. It's so tuned. And then Markov. Markov and Diada. Well, Markov and Diada are probably similar. And then Conrad. Maybe you flip a coin between them between like whatever two you have, I guess. Okay, odds, fairies, Ooh. evens, humans. Odds. Is that a six or a nine? It's an odd. Gotta reroll it. It's a good question. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fairies. Fairies. This, these are, blue is my weakest color that I, I don't know, play very well. But do you not want to play fairies? You sound, you sound just, so like, sad it's now. It's just counterspell. It's not my vibe. So don't There's play it, dude. Spells. Hey, listen. I just want you to have fun. Um, so if you want to play Markov, play Markov. I just... All I ask... I'm not going to play Markov. Say you're gentle know with me. I don't play fairies. I don't play fairies. No, because then I feel bad for hitting you, and I don't want to go through that, so... What? Play fairies. You can hit me. What is that supposed to mean? What if I make you hit Lupo? Would you feel bad then? What, what is that supposed to mean? You feel bad for hitting me? Well, you just said like it's powerful and you don't want me to hit you and so then I'd feel bad I if just I want to be able to do a thing. You. I don't mean kill like I'm, I'm, you could hit me. I just say don't fucking be like all right, I'm gonna swing at you for for 35 this this turn and I'm like, well, I don't have shit. Yeah, so like I'm 38 dead. on the I'm said like, 35, you like round said five? 35. Yeah, but like imagine if she did that All right, play whatever you want. It's fine <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing Grogu. 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 I love the Mandalorian and Pedro Pascal. And Pedro Pascal as the Mandalorian. Um.
All right, did you guys roll and all that already? Mm. No. Yet. No. We roll in one or two. Just do one. I got a one. I always get ones, twos, or fours. I don't know if I want to do this hand. Three. Um, I got a three. Four goes first. Whatever, I'll play it. Three, four, six, seven. Big bucks, no fucking whammies, dude. Let's see. This is relatively chill. Are we all good? Um, yeah. I suppose for now. For yeah, now. you good, yeah? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Beans. All right then. Oi. Oi. All right. Fuck. What are you saying? <laughs> what are you saying? Oh, now I want to watch Piggy Blinder. Tom Hardy, Thomas Shelby, Arthur Shelby, the Peaky fucking Blinder. Sorry, I think I'm being a little too much right now. Sorry. No, you're not. Don't apologize. Stop that. Okay. You're not enough, Electra. Be more. Like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you're not like a five. I need you at like a seven or eight. <laughs> <laughs> You're never too much. Take that energy you had for Steve and bring it to this game right now. Oh, fucking Steve! Oi! God. Right, Oi! Okay, go ahead. I'm ready. Right, drawing for turn. Uh, I will play a Throne of the High City. Tap for one for a ransom note. Don't worry, no soul ring. I don't have sleeves. Uh, survive one. I'll leave that up top and I pass the turn. Okay. Amy, can you put your commander in? Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm gonna draw. Who fucking called out? <gasps> Whoa! Okay, I'm so glad I kept this hand. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna play. Wow! Oh my god, this might be my best start yet. I'm so, I'm so excited. Be so excited for me. Okay, I'm gonna reveal an island so that this can be there, and then play. Oh wait. <laughs> no, I can't. <laughs> Because I can't play two lands. No, that doesn't make. No, I don't know. I can't. No, I just. I'll pass my turn. <laughs> All right. Next round. Next round. Next round. Just um, you wait. Next round. It's coming in hot. Tap one. Carry in soul cleaver. Pass. Soul cleaver. Soul cleaver. Cleaver. Oh, I hardly ever. Island. Equip three crowns. Right on one. When it enters battlefield, scry two. Mm. Scry two. I can like choose to put this back on top, but still look at this one. Yeah. Or no. Okay. Yeah, you take the top two and look at them, and put them back on uh, in any order, and anything at the bottom that you don't want. Hmm. Oh. Uh, I'll do that. Okay. Yes. Untap. Draw. Mountain. Tap for two. Mind stone and a pass. Mind stone. Mind stone. Draw for a turn. Draw for turn. Draw for turn. Wow. Pass it, get I shit will on. Play command tower, and then I will tap to to play an arcane signet. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. And that's all I can do. <laughs> to all <pass. laughs> <laughs> Untap, two draw, land for turn, tap two, also arcane signet, and pass. Pop off, king! Uh, Queen, you're playing Laura. Laura. Turn, I'll play Lala. another Lala. island, Lala. tap two, and for the fucking memes, arcane signet. Hell yeah! Wow. Hell All yeah! Right, Gunny, let's go, Gunny! Arcane signet, bitch, let's go! Woo, let's do it! Arcane That's signet in your stone. band! Uh, are, are you gonna attack games or? I guess I could, yeah. Hit um, somebody in the face. Hit me. Do it. No, hit me. No, hit me. Hit Gunny. He's playing Nelly. One, two, three, four. Yeah, five, that's six. true. Hit him because he is playing Nelly. That's Gunny. 
Yay! Johnny <laughs> takes one, shit on. One. one. Right. Untap, upkeep. The draw. Um. She's so, uh, she's so pretty. She's so pretty. It's well quaffed. I would want her to do so many. Do I want to? Mm. So many things to me. Oh my God! So many things. You know what? Let's get let's get started early. Nelly's in play. Pass the turn. I don't like that. Actually, no. She can't come and play. Alive. She can't come and play. Uh, Wait, yeah. What have... the fuck? Should you I... trying to cheat, bro? Uh, there. Look, Lonely Steve's in play now. I'm looking for a basic land put into play. Sawum Simawakwum. Yup. Uh, Electra, your cards are hiding off your cam, by the way. Oh, sorry. Okay. It's like yeah, one. my camera is like mm, is it like Zoom or something. That's, weird. that's that's already better. Yeah, I had to adjust some stuff on my PC. So okay, yeah, that's better. That makes sense. I was like, it, I don't think I changed it. Oh, is it my turn? Yes, you're up. Oh, okay. I draw. Um. Okay, I'll play an island. And then let's see what I want to do. I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, tap four and play Everquill Phoenix. It's a uh, creature with flying. It's a four, four creature with flying. Whenever this creature mutates, create a red artifact token named Feather. Uh, with if you play one colorless, sacrifice Feather and return target Phoenix card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Um, and then I'll pass. Okay. <coughs> uh, tower drop. Mountain. Um, She'll be coming round the mountain when you come. Um, the song's about Laura. <laughs> it could be. <laughs> Actually, who, who is that song about? Isn't um, it like... I'm gonna tap for green and one colorless <laughs> and play... It's okay. Play Bloom Tender. Way. Um, and then I will Fuck it, pass Okay, what'd you play? Bloom Tender Bloom Tender This tap for uh, each color among permanents you control Add one mana of that color. Right now, I could tap it for one green and that's it Two for a fellow war stone. I can tap for any land that y'all produce, which I just need blue and black, but y'all have blue. There's blue. no black. <laughs> That's fine. Um and then I'll go to combat. I think everyone has blockers now. So I will go ahead I'm and I'll find blockers though. Actually I'll... I have a four four flyer. You can't hit Electra, but you can hit me. I'll play this fire as well. Ooh, shit. Except I didn't really want to do this. Fine. Um, I watched the fire. Oh, that's cool. Wait, no, but Command Tower is only in their commander's identity and she doesn't have black. Sorry, I was correcting Michael. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, Michael. <laughs> um, I'll hit you, Ben. Ow. Okay. Pack pass. Untap. Upkeep draw. Uh, I've landed ship played last turn, and now I will bring uh, Miss Nelly into play. Uh, go to combat. I'll swing Solemn at Ains. 2 2. Solemn okay. Simulacra. Uh, I'll take two. He wants Warden the card draw. The <gasps> He's a Don't son of a bitch. Don't reveal my game plans. <laughs> um. All right. I'll play a forest. Um. And then, wait. How much is he? Oh. What's the This crazy shenanigans oh, bullshit that I got going on right now. Guy. <coughs> I don't know if it's good or bad. We'll see. I just built it tonight. I'll tap everything. Get Miss, Mr. Gimbal out. Gimbal. Um, artifact creatures you control have trample. At the beginning of your instep, create a zero zero red gremlin artifact creature token. Put X one one counters on it, where X is the number of differently named artifact 
tokens you control. I don't control any tokens at the moment. Um, but let's see. Who has flyers? Wait, Amy flyer. has a flyer and that's it. Yep, nobody else has flyers. Okay. Yours is a way bigger flyer than my one flyer that's open. Oh yeah, Everquill's a 4-4. Four four. He's, he's a thick boy. Hmm. I would like to say that Nelly's in play, so if you hit one of them, you and I both draw a card. That's oh, true. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna hit Amy. <laughs> four, four, are you? Four, one, two, three, four. And then we'll draw a card. Pog. Sorry, Amy. Okay, I'll pass. Don't apologize. <laughs> Untap. Draw. Oof. Um. That's too bad. Actually, that's okay. Uh, green, red, blue. Uh, get my Tomb Raider out. She's gonna have any ETBs. Um, but let's see here. One, two, three, four. Now, uh, if I wanted to. Mm -mm. Ranger, I got that one out. I got that one out. Okay. Um, tap this for uh, one green, one blue, one red, because I've got those three colors there now, plus an additional blue to play Urza, Lord High Artificer. When ETBs create a zero, zero colorless creature token, uh, colorless construct artifact creature token, with this creature gets plus one, plus one for each artifact you control. This is going to come out as a 3-3. Three, three. Uh, and then I can tap un an untapped artifact uh, to add one blue if I would like to. Which uh, one is he? Sorry. Urza, Urza Lord, Lord High, Lord High Art. Artificer. Yep. Okay. And then I will pass the turn. I'm going to find a construct uh, creature token if I can. Okay. Um, I'll tell okay. me if I can attack my headphones or unplug. A swamp. And I will... Tap three. Or tag will. Flying death touch. Other fairies have a plus one, plus one. And whenever a fairy dies, I draw a card and lose a life. <clears throat> um, and I'll go to combat. And I will swing my two flyers. I'll send one flyer at Gunny and one flyer at Ben. I will send the two at you, Gunny, and one at Ben. Or oh, sorry, three and then two is because of tech wall. So three to you and then two to Ben. And then I will pass turn. Uh, you and I draw a card, don't forget. Because you are hitting Ben. Oh. And now he's out. Cool. Does that okay. change what you want to do at the end of your turn? Um. Uh, no, I'll, I'll, I'll keep the same. I'm back, uh, on your end step, I will pay to sack this to uh, draw a card. Then I hit you for two. Okay. I'm assuming it was in the area. Yeah. Ow! Did you get your card draw from that? She did. Oh, from Nelly? Yeah. yeah. Does it work even though I hit you as well, Gunny? Yep. Yes. Because it says as long as a creature hits uh, an opponent. Okay. Uh, I'll play a planes. Then I will tap for two, three, four. I will play, where is it? Uh, trouble in pairs. If an opponent would begin an extra turn, that player skips that turn instead. Whenever an opponent attacks me with two or more creatures, draws their second card each turn, or casts their second spell each turn, I draw a card. Nice. Card. Uh, a lot of words. See. It was. Wait, what uh, is it called? It's not. I don't, none of my stuff is uh, scanning. Sorry. Trouble in pairs. Yep. Uh, go to the combats. I will 
wing. Solemn at Lupo, and I will swing Nelly at uh, Electra on attack. I will suspect. Um, I will suspect. The artifact tokens may have been going. This guy? Yep. Okay. Uh, he's got a menace. He can't block now. That's so sad. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, I'm gonna just fucking smack your solemn simulacrum. Uh, you can have the card draw. I don't care. Yay. And then you you attacked Electra with Nelly? Yep. Yeah, I took the two. And then... You ticked up your gimbal damage, Electra. You gotta do it on Nelly, not your own commander. Oh, wait, did I do? Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah. Uh, I might as well just do this now. I'm gonna play a card called Hot Pursuit. I'm going to go the, I'm gonna go the uh, tag well. <laughs> and he is goaded for as long as this remains in the battlefield. That's rude. Amy's and so then... pissed, she's speechless. <laughs> oh, I thought I was <laughs> muted. Okay. No, so sorry. he's he's just goaded. Yeah, he's just goaded yep. until that uh, enchantment leaves. Okay. Or I assume if he dies and comes back, uh, then I will pass the turn to you, Electra. Okay. I will untap. Um. Raw. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Indeed. Hmm. I'm playing island. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Um. Let me. Hmm. That means my artifact token is good as well. Okay, I am going to tap, let's see, one. Wait, if I tap, hold on. Sorry, I'm trying to look at this. You're good. Oh, never mind. Okay. No worries. Yeah, I think. Yeah, if I. All right, I'm tapping six, and I am going to play uh, Thopter Assembly. Uh, five, five flyer at the beginning of your upkeep if you control no Thopters other than Thopter Assembly. Um, return it to its owner's hand and create five, one, one colorless Thopter artifact creature tokens with flying. Thopter. Thopter. <laughs> Um, and he's an artifact creature, so then I have three artifact. I'm just trying to keep track of it. Wait, is this a token? Oh yeah, it is. Yep. So then my, I have tokens one. I just have to keep track of it because then I have a lot of stuff on it. Um. Yeah. Okay. So this guy is a 1-1 one, one red gremlin uh, with trample. Everyone has trample. These two have flying. Scary. This guy has trample. How scary. Very scary. Um, okay. And... Amy's wait, who's goaded? Um my construct is and Tegwell is. Tegwell uh, flying death touch. Yeah, Tegwell can block is he is goaded, not suspected. Yeah, construct, construct. is suspected. He's got menace and can't block. Okay. Um you know how many flyers, right, Ben? I don't. Oh I don't. you know what? 
I just realized that Lara Croft oh, she has, has reach. reach and she I, has reach. I could have blocked earlier and didn't, unless it would have killed me. Killed. It doesn't matter. I just, I'm learning the deck. So yeah, she's got reach. Hey. Okay. She's got um, bows and shit. I will swing four at you. She also, um, I don't know if you noticed, has Red Rebel. And so if anyone has Paracord, we can go out the Red Rebel Extract. <laughs> so I'll put that out there in case anybody's curious. You can go that way. Uh, you said you're attacking with a, a four? Yeah, I'm swinging a four four at you. That's pretty heckin' rude, bud. I think I'm going to take the four, but I'm not happy about it. Okay. Great. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, great. Awesome. Thanks. Oh you my God. Draw Electra. We draw. Okay. Yeah, it's not a, the bow, it's her period. Her pyramid boobs give her reach. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then oh, but Tag will can block, right? Yeah. He's got death touch. That's true. Oh, are you not done declaring attackers yet? No. Oh, sorry. No. That's okay. My bad. Well, I think I'd probably just swing gimbal at Amy. It's a four four. Okie dokie. Um. Oh wait, actually. Oh, sorry. I'm still block with Tagwell. Just heads yeah. up. Tagwell can block, and you guys would trade. You both would die. Yeah. <coughs> uh, okay. I, I can't have... block Tagwell. Well, I can, but it's not a good block for me. If you want to. I do have a question. Way. What's up? Uh, learning on my end mm -hmm. if like hypothetically so she sends it at me and then can I block and before he dies like return him to my hand if I had a card that did that and then he wouldn't go to the graveyard but it would still block gimbal you could declare the blocker so the guy's blocked and then you could bounce Tegwill and the guy would not do any damage to you and combat would end okay so yeah, in then response will... to yourself declaring uh, Tegwell as a block. So I will do that. And then in response, I'll play Quickling. It has Flash, Flying, and when it ETB, sacrifice it unless you return another creature you control to its owner's hand. There you go. So Tegwell. And boom. So is he dead? No, nothing happens. Oh, okay. Your guy doesn't die. Tegwell goes back to Amy's hand and no, no damage is dealt. Cool. Okay. I don't understand that, but I'll get to a point where I can. It's just and I don't want I don't want you to have to like <laughs> go through trying to explain it again. Okay. Basically, your guy just swung at empty air. Yep. Okay. He thought. Well, okay. When, when okay, sorry. When you're saying bounce, because like Cam does that a lot. He's like, I'm gonna bounce this and then do that and then I'm bouncing this. So like, what, what does that mean? Bounce is is returning a thing to your hand. Why and the, when and how can you do that? So she's got a spell. So she played Quickling, and it says mm -hmm. uh, it's got Flash. So she played it at instant speed. Um, and said when Quickling enters the battlefield sacrifice it unless you return another creature you control to its owner's hand or her own hand so okay. she declared Tegwell as a blocker before combat damage is done before the guys hit each other you know there, here's the two dudes right and, mm -hmm. and your guy's over here and he's like I'm gonna hit you and Tegwell's like I'm gonna block and then they're like just kidding bye and your guy's oh, okay, like okay. Uh, I don't do anything then okay. and that's it cool all right also uh, for chat, uh, Roach, uh, he was just uh, goaded. He was not the suspect. Uh, suspected. So actually, now when Tegwill comes back, he the won't be target. Goated. Yeah, the target of the enchantment is gone. So nothing. I was gonna do it on it. your end step if no one attacked me. But. Yeah, that's smart. All right, um, untap, <laughs> upkeep, and draw. All right, du -du 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 -du. let's see. How do we want to do this? You know, How, what do we want to do here, dude? Blue. Okay. Uh, tap this for one, two, three. Uh, Urza is gonna uh, tap uh, Carry and Soul Cleaver for one, so that's four. Um, Five six to play Chamil, the inner sun. Spells you control can't be countered, and at the beginning of my end step, I will discover five. 
Uh, I'm going to land for turn and bounce an island for cruel turf back into my hand. Uh, and then I have one, two, technically three mana left. That's one of each. That's so silly. Um, I will tap two and I will equip Tarion Soul Cleaver to Lara Croft. Uh, so she now has Vigilance, and then whenever another artifact or creature is put into a graveyard from the battlefield, she gets a 1-1. One, one. Okay. Um, let's see here. <sighs> Amy, you've got uh, Quickling. I can't attack Gunny with the Construct, but I can attack him... Nelly's at 2-4, right? Yep. Did do much to you. And Electra. Ooh, Electra, you've got just got one blocker, right? Uh, I have a 5-5 five, five and a 1-1. 5-5 one, one. Five, five with flying and a 1-1. One, one. Where's the 1-1? One, one? Oh, the gremlin. The little yeah, yeah. fucking gremlin guy. Dang mm -hmm. it, so you can block. That's sucky. Yes. So it's a 5-5? Five, five. Mm-hmm. Five five was flying. Gross. Okay. Um, and trample. I'm gonna hit you, Amy, for four. She's got menace. Okay, take four. Yeah. Um, and at the end of combat of your turn, if you attack this turn, create a treasure. Make a treasure. He goes up to a five five. Don't forget to draw your card. Yeah, uh, draw a card because I attacked. Cool. Uh, attack somebody that wasn't gunny. And uh, during my end step, I will discover five. Uh, Solemn Simulacrum is going to get played. When the ETBs, I can search my library for a basic land card, put it on the battlefield, tapped, then shuffle. I'm going to do that. Um, and I will pass my turn. You cast that off Discover, right? Yes. So that's your second spell, so I will draw off of Trouble and Pairs. Yes, you should. Um, I also forgot that to make another Red Gremlin, and it's Go going to be... A one one, so I think I'm trying to think. This guy technically would well, so it's saying to create a zero zero red gremlin artifact, but then put X one one counters on it, where X is a number of artifact tokens, and this is the only artifact token that I control right now. So, so would, would it just be a one two. one? No, you, he would come so, out with two. Yeah, he enters the battlefield. You control him, and then he uh, you uh, will have two, so he would be a two two. Wait, how do I have two? If this is the only one that I have. At the beginning of your end step, create a 0, zero red gremlin artifact creature token. Put X11 one, one counters on it, where X is a number of differently, oh, differently named artifact differently tokens. Differently named, Sorry, yeah. I didn't read so, that part. So he would just be, you'd have two one ones then. Okay. I bet. Yeah, yeah. I was just making sure, because I, yeah. Because the differently named part is the thing that I missed there. Mm-hmm. Okay, um, I'm going to... Just have that instead. I'm gonna tap three to play Tag Will. Again. So I'll get plus one. Welcome when back, he dies, I draw a card. He has Death Touch. I missed him. <laughs> and then... As much as I want to do that, I think I need to not... I will move to combat. Cam ha or Cam, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny too, because I'm not even talking to one of the dudes. I'm about to talk to Ash. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> how many flyers do you have? I have one that can block. Oh, uh, how big is he? He's a 5-5. Five 5-5. Five. Five five. I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Um, but I'm also fine with that. Um, I'm going to send One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, six, six now. Okay, I'm sending a three, three at you and a two, two at you. Fly. Ooh, shit. Yeah. You can kill one. There's nothing funny about it except if you kill one, I'll get a card. Okay, um, I'll kill the three, three. Just draw a card. 
Ooh. Then you would draw a card off of Nelly since you did them. All ones unblocked, right? Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Um, I forgot how pretty this deck is. And then I will... Um, you know what? Fuck it. Yeah. I don't pay for and I'm play a roaming throne. Oh, God. <coughs> I didn't r realize that was in this deck, that's me. Um... <laughs> uh, I choose fairies. Uh, triggered ability triggers additional time and then I will oh I lose a life for a fairy dying and I'll pass turn uh, untap upkeep dwarf. oh my god uh, I will play <coughs> a plane for the turn um uh... Uh, I'll tap one planes for a soul snare. I can pay one light to sacrifice an exile target creature that's attacking me or a planeswalker I control. Oh. Soul snare. Um, Question If say like it's on my turn and I attack both Ben and Amy, would I draw two or would I only just, draw just one? one. Sorry, I didn't know how that worked. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Yeah, because it says the wording, Electra, is whenever one or more creatures in opponent controls deal combat mm -hmm. damage. So it's just okay. saying, you know, any number, as long as you hit another another player, that isn't gummy. Okay. Um, what else do I want to do? I don't think Roaming Throne would be good in here um, because I might as well try and Artifact the isn't a creature um, type. Well, in regards to my donuts, one, two, hey, Chris, on. three. Chris, get that bucket, brother. Yeah, Jared, I was thinking, I thought about doing Roaming Throne. And a white buff. I don't think it would be good. Uh, Brash Conter. Oh, fuck. Cool. He is a little 1 1 indestructible dude that whenever he takes damage, he deals that much damage to target opponent. And I can pay one red, two colorless, tap him, and he fights another creature. That guy, if you can exile him, Electro, is very good to exile. Yeah. Or give him, or give him no, minus one, minus one. I remember because you played them against me and that was not very fun. What? <laughs> uh, what? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. That's so crazy you would say that. What you're talking about, Willis? That is so crazy. Tank, uh, that's crazy. I'll go to combat. I'm going to swing Nelly at Electra just to get the damage through. I'm going to... Uh, even though I know it's going to be sacrificed, I'm going to suspect the, uh, your doctor thingamajig. That guy is, just, is suspected so. now. So he's goaded, he has menace, and he can no longer block. <clears throat> okay. And you're so, attacking me with Nelly? With Nelly. 2-4. Yep. <clears throat> I will. Hey, Amy, did your quickling die? Yeah. What happened? I missed it. Uh, I blocked one of. I'll take two. You blocked or, a thing? I, no, I didn't. Ash blocked. Oh, one that's right. Blocked it, and I got the card draw off of it. Okay. I forgot to put the 1 1 counter on uh, Lara Croft because of uh, Terry and Soul Cleaver. Hmm. Uh, I have seven cards in hand, so I will end my turn and pass it to Electra. Okay. I will untap. Um, draw. Oh, at the at the beginning of your yeah, upkeep, you know what I just if realized? you control no Thopters other than Thopter Assembly, I create five one one. Because Urza's is out, I can tap treasure flying. tokens for blue mana, so and they don't get sacrificed. And then you return that to your hand. And then I return this to my hand, so it's no longer goaded, suspected, suspected yep. whatever. Yeah. Um. Okay. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? But only blue. That's fine though, because I have red and green out I here. It's no big deal. And I've got an arcane signet. Bro, what the fuck? Game truck. Did I make a nasty deck? Truck. And I'll show a forest in order to play it. 
untapped. Um, I am going to tap two uh, to play Simic Signet, which is another artifact. So this goes to five. And then, um, and these are creature, oh, that's right. Sorry, let me yep. look. I think they are. So I have two different types of tokens. Now they're all um, two twos. So yeah, all of these go. Well, new ones will become Wait. two twos. Yeah, new ones become two twos. Yep. Okay. That's cool. Um, Would you one, make five two. fucking doctors? Yep. Because <laughs> of Thopter assembly, if I if this was the only Thopter that I had at my upkeep, then uh, Jared, I make I'd five say, one one Thopters uh, and return angels it to my hand. Are probably the most is probably the most powerful. And he tech. was goaded. Uh, Tay, yeah. Or suspected or whatever. Also, we're still working on that. There's um, dude, there's been some fucking delays about. It remind me to talk about charity stuff uh today at the end of this mm. um but there's some delays because of a, a shipping issue at saint jude the other thing that happens is we give people a shitload of time to respond to getting hit up for stuff so he's do going I through the list of things do I want to it's still it's still happening mana. um I think I'm it's bac it. wait 22 so wait, actually, two years I... ago okay Tap that this, then I get two three okay four, let me look five, into that six. too if, if you got the year right, so I'd have to tap that. one to tap this for two. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'm gonna tap everything else. Um, and play Thopter Assembly again. Oh shit! Shit. Um. Okay, and then I'll move to combat. Let's say here. You don't have any flying blockers, right, Gunny? I do not, no. Okay. Ben, do you have this flying blockers? This deck is missing flying. Laura? Uh, she I is. don't have... Oh, I have reach. She I have has a, reach. I have a 4-5 with reach right now. 4-5 with reach. And then Amy, who do you have for flyers? Uh, I have Tegwell, he's a 2-3 with Death Touch, and then I have this guy, he is a 3-2, um, and then I have this guy, he's not flying, but he's a 5-5. Five, five. Okay. Um, so she has Vigilance, uh, Migboom, from right. um, uh, the Amy, Terrian I'm gonna Soul send so a she's four, okay. four at you. She's okay for now. In the air. Okay. And then... <coughs> so I could have clapped that. These have summoning sickness, right? Yep. Okay. Yep. But I draw a card because I hit Amy. Well, not yet, I guess. Hammer's in here too, McBoom. Um. Yes, sir. Plus, I got some mean shit coming up. I gotta, I gotta start working on. Gunny. I feel like I should be doing Plus, more. Gunny's gonna get get away from us. But I also kind of like having a lot of blockers. I might uh, be a little. Wesley, silly right shoot now. an email again. But this has so many sickness. This one has. I don't want my commander to die. I think what you're doing is smart, okay. especially with how you're walking through it right now. I think that's good too, because like mm -hmm. you said, you don't want your commander to die. He's your engine. Yeah. Either mm -hmm. two are really small that if you were to send them at any of us, we're just going to kill them. So then you wouldn't yeah, have exactly. any blockers. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, I will block with this guy. He will die and I'll draw a card and lose a life. Okay. And then I draw a card because of Nelly, uh, right? No, because she did not. It's going to uh, take, take combat damage. damage. Yep. Oh, true. Okay. Did you attack oh, um, with Nelly? I actually lose turn? one more life and I draw another card. Sorry. <laughs> Who, me? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I attacked uh, Electra. I suspected <laughs> the old Thopter. Thopter assembly. Oh, gotcha. So I was looking for the, other, for the other suspect token. Gotcha. Yeah. And then a creature just died, right? Uh, yes, Ames jumped. Yes. Okay, cool. Got it. Um, okay, and then in my end step, I'm going to make a 2-2 two, two red gremlin and pass my turn. Gremlin. Gremlin. Okay. Uh, untap. 
uh, upkeep and draw. Uh, land for turn is going to be an island that I bounced earlier. Uh, we will tap Bloom Tender for three to put out Whisper Silk Cloak. Uh, and then I will tap... Uh, I'm going to tap the treasure token for one blue mana, but I don't have to sacrifice it because Urza exists. Uh, and then uh, one more to equip Whisper Silk Cloak to my commander. She now has Shroud and cannot be blocked. I'm just going to put this up to a 7-7. Seven, seven. Okay. Um, let's see here. What else do we want to do for fun? Uh, tab these two. That's two green and one colorless to play the Bow of Nylia. Uh, I was going to put this up to eight. Uh, attacking creatures I control now have Death Touch. Uh, and then I can pay two and choose one of these. I can put a 1 1 counter on a creature, deal two damage to a creature with flying. I can gain three life or put up to four cards in my graveyard on the bottom of my library in any order. Um, da, 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 da. I'm gonna tap Arcane Signet to get out a uh, Delighted Halfling, who's a mana dork, and I can tap for a cult, a one color, um, one mana of any color to cast a legendary spell uh, that prevents it from being countered. Um, and then I'm gonna tap these two to play uh, Subterranean Schooner, uh, which is a vehicle. Uh, whenever uh, when it, it attacks creatures, uh, target creature that crewed it this turn gets to explore. Um, I'm now at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this guy is a nine nine uh, with menace and death touch. Um, Gunny, I'm going to hit you for five with my commander. Uh, she is unblockable. And I am going to attack uh, Electra with a 9 9 with uh, Death Touch and Menace. Okay. okay. Um, I'll block with both of my red gremlins and they'll die. Yep. Cool. Uh, two creatures died. Oh, wait, put into the graveyard. Never mind. Sorry. Going back. Going back. The uh, token's still telling me to go to the graveyard. Did, so do they tell you to go to the graveyard and then disappear? I'm pretty... Like 99% certainly do. Yeah. Actually, now that you mentioned that, I think that's right. Okay. Um, and then during my end step, uh, I'm going to discover five. Uh, the, fuck, the cube. Uh, the canine cube. Mark 1 comes out. I'm going to cast... That's... If you haven't drawn a card for a second, um... oh, I did because you casted Whisper Silk and something else, to, and the bow. That's what it was. Yep. Technically, now that I think about it, this card was on top when I did the discover. Uh, I did I do combat damage to? Oh, I did combat damage to you, Gunny. And yeah. I didn't uh, actually Electra do damage to Electro. Uh, Never yeah. mind. This one does go to the bottom. I don't get that card draw. Um, so that's out. Puts this up to a ten ten, and I will my turn. Oh, I make another treasure token um, because I attacked. So I'll get, a, I'll get another token. Hmm. The vehicle I played, uh, it is. I play uh, distant melody. Choose a creature type. Draw a card for each permanent you control of that type. It's Fairies, subterranean I'll draw schooner. Three cards. I'll draw off of trouble and pairs. This guy. <coughs> I 
The deck is doing things though. Like that's and cool. then I if will I get shit on combat. it, at least I tried. Like I, it went. Mm, Bendia flyers. Uh, you have I, reach. I have reach on my uh, commander right now, uh, who is a uh, seven eight. Mm. All right, I will pass turn and I will discard down the hand size. I'm going to discard, um, dark water catacombs and uh, I will play a mountain for turn. So, looking at the shit that I have out, chat, it's a lot. Um, because uh, Grim Whisper can be tapped for blue, this uh, Chamil can okay. be tapped for blue. I think I have Both to treasure tokens will be tapped for blue. I have to do this, I should say. Uh, um, he's gonna he's gonna hit me for eleven here in a second. If he's smart, he's gonna um, fight with one, his two, rush taunter. Three, four. So I got a fucking five. eleven, eleven out right now. Uh, I'm attempting to cast Winds of Wrath. Destroy all creatures uh, that aren't enchanted. I think I'm fine with this. I'm not. <laughs> I think all my stuff dies. Yeah. Shit. It resolves for me. Uh, any responses from Ben? I'm looking. Hold on. Destroy all creatures that aren't. Yes. Okay. Um, I lose four life and draw four cards. Nelly will die. Anybody got triggers for shit dying? I do. Uh, yeah. Oh wait, she's she's not enchanted. Fuck, she's gonna die. That's okay. Uh, you said you do uh, have they triggers can't be for stuff dying. Regenerated, so I would it, would they go into exile? No, regenerated is just a is a mechanic where you pay a cost and the thing doesn't oh, die okay. basically. Uh, so it's got a different, it. different mechanic. Um, do you want me to tell you how many creatures I have die? Who? You said you had a, a trigger on, thi on things oh, dying. Oh, I just meant like I had death triggers for Tagwell. Oh, Sorry. Okay. I was confused by what you said. <clears throat> nice job, Ben. Um, thank you. That was good. I will. Um, actually, no. I will. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, do I want to? Brash Taunter's indestructible. That's gross. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's yeah. such a he's such a little rat. A little rat. <laughs> well, because you call him a rat, he's gonna swing at you for one. Hey, huh? <laughs> I'll block with my karate chop. Uh, I get a card draw of Solemn Simulacrum, Simulacrum dying. By the way, so put that out there. Yep, yep. Uh, that's all I'll do for turn. Go to my end step. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have to discard the hand size. Discarding uh, care keep. And I pass the turn. All right. Well, now I got to figure out what I'm going to do. That was a pretty necessary board wipe. Yeah, that definitely was. I was getting we were, fat. I, I was about to do a thing. Oh, I was getting hella fat. <laughs> you know what? If you play something big, Electro, make it worth your while. If you don't swing at me. Well, I wouldn't be able to because I don't think any of my stuff has haste. Uh, I can give you haste. How? This land, Slayer Stronghold. I can pay a white and a red and tap it. Target creature gets plus two, plus O, Vigilance and Haste until end of turn. Oh, shit. All right, let me see. I'm gonna do this. Oh, I didn't draw. Hey, well, I guess I'll freaking do that. I'll play a soul ring. Always on time. 
Yeah. No Perfect. Point. Perfect. Wonderful. Soul I love that. My artifacts <coughs> go up to three. Anyways. <laughs> oh, I have a thing that I want to do, but I think I need to wait to do that. Trying to think, um, dude? Yeah, I want to do it. I'm, I'm going to do a thing, but I'm going to wait to do the thing, you know? <coughs> All right, I guess I'll just do this. Um, I'll tap these two and then my soul ring and play a uh, whirler rogue. Uh, when he enters the battlefield, create two one one colorless uh, thopter artifact creature tokens mm -hmm. um so technically i have two but i need to keep track of what differently named ones i have so i'm just gonna do one um thop 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 how much would I need to get him out? Um, seven. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Damn it. <laughs> um, um, I'm gonna do this now because my man on my word. I'm going to tap red and a white. I'll tap this and I'll give your uh, world <laughs> rogue uh, haste and vigilance until end of turn. <laughs> oh, let's go. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Wait, but you said because I could hit you, but then now I'd feel bad because then you helped me. Well, I said no, as long as you don't hit me. Okay, with, okay, with, uh, no. okay, true. Uh, at least for, ben, what for do this you one have? turn. I have no blockers, bud. You got no blockers? Hit me in the face, please. I'm gonna hit you for four. How are you hitting me for four? Because uh, it's, it's only the the whirler road. Only the whirler road. Uh... You hit me for two. Those those stopters don't have haste though. No, no, I know, but wait, I thought it was a plus two zero. Oh, wait, is Where it? Oh, no, it, it is, it is, sorry, yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah plus two zero, so I hit you for four. Wow, now I don't want you to hit me. That's fucked up. I took four, <laughs> now I'm mad. Woohoo, let's go. All right, Ben, I'll pass my turn to you. Okay. <laughs> That's okay, I understand. Untap, upkeep, and draw. Oh, cool. sorry. I didn't read the bottom of this. Am I supposed to then also do that? No, you can. You, so you can, I can do it the, at any time. Yeah, you can pay yep. the cost of tapping two untapped artifacts you control, like your thopters. Oh, and okay. Make your guy unblock. One of your guys unblock. Oh, okay, okay. Well, it's target creature, so you can make anything unblockable if you want. I guess technically, yeah, you could do it to another. If you wanted to do it to another person's thing, like, fucking go for it, I guess. Okay. Uh, you can cause two, some real three. chaos with that. Uh, buh, 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 four, five. Get Lara Croft back out onto oh, the battlefield. Uh, sorry, she casts a soul ring on the thopter or the brother of so I'm gonna draw a card. Sorry. Yeah, hey, you're good. Um, uh, I'm gonna land for turn and put out the Shia. Motherfucking Shire, dude. Sheesh. That's the Shia. Oi. I'm gonna go do the shy. Do you wanna do that? Do you wanna do that now or do you wanna wait and do that later? I'll probably do that now then. Uh tap two and I'm gonna put uh Whisper Silk Cloak back on uh Lara. She cannot be blocked and has shrewd. Uh and then uh, I'm gonna go to combat. Do I want to? Yeah, we'll go to combat. Um, I'm gonna tap Lara to crew the subterranean schooner. Um, I'm gonna hit Gunny for three. She's gonna explore. Uh, Matt Salanti, the great door, is going to go back on top. She gets plus one, plus one. Uh, but it doesn't change the amount of damage. You still just take three. And I took the three. Yes, sir. And I will go to end step and discover five. It's Matsalanti, the great door. That's crazy. Uh, it's going to ETB. 
Uh, and then in... And then I'll draw because that's your second card you casted. Yes. Uh, and then I will... Pass. Mm, on your end step, I'm going to pay three and flash in Scion of Una. Una? Flash mm. flying, other fairies have plus one, plus one, and all my fairies have Shroud. Ooh. Ooh. Except for that one. That one can get blasted. What's, what's Shroud? It uh, can't be targeted by spells or abilities, right? Yep. Anybody. Nice. E- e- even the ones that the owner casts on it. Yep. Mm-hmm. Um, Sorry, also, with my artifacts, am I counting that right? Do these count as artifacts? Uh-huh. They're yep. artifact tokens. Mm-hmm. So I do have five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. I just want to... Okay. Thank you. Yep, yep. Um, tap four. I'm going to play a grave pack. Whenever a creature you control dies, each other player sacrifices a creature. Ooh, hate that. That's a cool card. That is is rough. Yeah. I don't think I have any removal here, (laughs) Chef. Oops. I will pass turn. She's got so much untapped land. Scary. (laughs) I have one too many cards in my hand, so I will discard down a hand size. I don't like that. Uh, Mm. uh, Untap, upkeep, and wall. Uh, I will play a Sunhome Fortress. Rogue Frog, yeah. The boat can target uh, Laura. Yes. Uh, 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 question. Does anyone have anything really of importance in their graveyard, like creature-wise? I don't um, know that I want to answer that. Why? Anything big or scary in their graveyard they want back? Oh, they want back? Yeah. Um, I don't know what grave recursion is in this deck, if any, but I do have a Roaming Throne. Hers is probably... pretty cool. I like Bloom Ursa. Tender because mana. I have one that I would bring back. Which one's that? Well, probably the the Phoenix. The Phoenix. You know what? I think the Phoenix is a good thing to bring back. What the heck? <laughs> Uh, a planes and a mind someone cast a spell called Immortal Obligation. Return target creature cards from the opponent's graveyard to the battle. Who doesn't target control with a duty counter on uh, it? Big boom. Uh, as long as that creature has it does a duty have counter shroud, on it, it's but crew doesn't can't target attack me or planeswalkers I control, and I can't block creatures I control. It's a uh, oh, cruise text is not hey, tap crazy. target creature. That's wild. Um, it's it's I'll take it. Tap, sure. Uh, tap creature, uh, you know, X creatures with um, power greater than the crew I number. Do. Um, oh. I just looked it up. Yeah, it we're good. And e- either way, I could have tapped it and tap then put the thing on. I just changed the, the order. Uh, but two, I'm good to do what I just three, put right there. And four. I'll play Windborn Muse. Oh, wait. Target creature that is two, three, three flyer. Floors. The mechanic Creatures can't does. attack me unless their controller pays two for each creature that controls attacking me. Wouldn't it change anything other than the 1-1 one, one mm. counter? Yeah. Is it touch the board? Sorry, hey. uh, I missed what, what what you were doing. I was talking to chat about a thing. What's up? Uh, I brought Windborn back... Muse? Yeah, I brought back the Phoenix with a mortal obligation, and then... Uh, yeah, Windborn Muse is currently on the stack. Okay. Alright. Uh, then... I actually... I will... I, just real quick, I double-checked a thing. You can crew with a creature with, with a creature with a shroud with a mechanic of this of target creature explores. Uh, can't do that. It would not have changed the, the card that hit the board, but I don't get the plus one, plus one. Fixing that, sorry. Okay. No worries. Um, so then... I just have to remember I next time to is, not put that I on until I turn. So I'm I'm four, done five, doing the explore thing. 
Technically, I could have done it the other way around, kept the 1-1, one, one, um, but I didn't, is so. Do for the turn? Yeah, I think it is all one do for the turn, so I pass. Okay. Watch wall. I will untap. Let's see what the heck is going to happen here. Give me something good. Oh, okay. <laughs> not that. She actually got the best card in her deck. Uh, no, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she wants us to think. Nope, it's awful, actually. <laughs> not at all what I wanted. I'm going to play a forest. Okay, can you guys explain the mutate for the phoenix? So if I pay the three colorless, one red, mutate, and I put it on this human, and so then if I put this on top, it's a 4-4 four, four flyer, but I can still use the stuff underneath here, right? Yes. So uh, you either put it on top or underneath, and then mm -hmm. whatever's on top, that's the power and toughness with those abilities, plus you get the abilities of everything underneath it. I think okay. it has to be in your hand, though. Yeah, you have to cast it from your hand. You cast it for the mutate cost instead of its uh, cast cost on the top right. So if it was in your hand, you would pay the one red, three colorless, and then you would put that either on top or underneath a non-human creature. So I can't mutate it? If, is it already on the board? Well, he brought it back. Yeah, then you can't Did mutate you bring it. it back onto the board or? Yes, yes. Yep. Oh, I can't uh, mutate it? You can't it? mutate it. You have to mutate from your hand. Oh, I, okay. I didn't know that. Yep. Um, okay. Let me look at my stuff. Um, all right. I am annoyed with myself. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to play. I'm going to tap this in this. Um, so that'd be the four colorless that I need. And then I'm going to tap this, this, and then this one. So that's seven and i'll get gimbal back out i don't know where the heck to put him um well, let me see amy what blocker is that that's a one one flyer yes if it dies, we all have to sack a creature. Oh, true. It was great back. Although I don't think she blocked that one because it's a really good one. <laughs> but Plus she's also a psycho, so maybe. <laughs> <laughs> um, hmm. And then Ben, what blockers do you have? Uh, none right now, actually. Okay. Um, I'll hit you for four, Commander. And then I'm gonna... Uh, what? That has some things I believe is you. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Yup. Thank you. Um... Then instead... The Phoenix can attack, though. Oh, this one can? Okay. Yep, because it was brought back before the start of your turn. Yeah, it was so. brought back during Gunny's turn. So okay. So you don't have some sickness. You hit me? Mm, Gunny, I'm going to attack you Ooh. with a 4-4 flyer. Fuck yeah. And... Um, you have to pay... Uh, well, she cannot because of the immortal obligation. Yeah. Oh, has, I can't attack you with it? With that feeling. Yeah, because it has a duty counter on it. And for as long as that creature mm -hmm. has that duty counter on it, it is goaded and can attack and cannot attack me or a permanent I, I control. Ah. And you cannot block my creatures with that creature. Okay. Sorry, Ben. Hey, it's okay. I'll, I'll take you four, for yeah. four. Yeah, you take four. Yeah. Um I had twenty five. Then... That's owie. Yeah. Okay, I'll pass. Let you out here bullying people, geez. Uh you <laughs> don't pass. You have a a gimbal trigger. 
Oh, yeah. oh yes. Sorry, I say that, but then I was gonna like write it as I was going. Oh yeah, I'll create a. Uh, let's get a card. Let's oh wait, no, Nelly's not out. Never mind. No Nelly's not out. Just kidding. I think I only have, I only have one. Um, so it's only a one. Wait, no, it's a two-two. Yep, because that is its own unique token. So. Okay. And then I'll pass. Okay. Thanks, Amy. Mm hmm. Tamperino. Uh, upkeep and draw. <clears throat> Ooh, I don't like that. Um, let's see here. You, what's what are your creatures over there, Gunny? Uh, Brash Tonner and oh, Wind, yeah. Brash Windborn Muse. Yeah. That's sucky. That guy's so annoying. Yeah. Yeah, he is. He is so crazy. Um, he just something real quick. He's every person in ever. He just sits there talking shit to you. Just taunting you. I fucking hate that guy. Brashly. I fucking, I fucking, I fucking hate him. I fucking hate that guy. Oh man, very interesting, very interesting situation. So this one is, um, oh, whoop. there you go. I wish I'll do what I was gonna do. Imagine I had an altar. That'd be so funny. Yeah, I wouldn't really like that. Is there an altar in that <laughs> deck? Uh, I don't believe so. No. Sweet baby Jesus, thank you. Um, <laughs> at that point, I'm like, I oh, just just fucking kill me. Um, it would be very it'd be playing the deck, blue control. Blue things. Uh, tap two. I'm gonna put Soul Cleaver back on uh, Ms. Croft, so that she can Croft things to death. Hopefully. The, does she have shroud? Yeah, but equip doesn't target. Oh really? Okay. Does as far as, as far as I know, same with uh, crewing. Oh, I guess it does. Big boom, is that true? Oh yeah, yeah that is it is true. Okay, well let me back it up then. Uh we'll do it this way. We're gonna Okay. Um We're gonna crew the subterranean uh schooner. Okay. We're gonna tap one, two. We're gonna throw Whisper Silk Cloak onto that. You're making me do it that way. I'm gonna tap two. I'm gonna put Tarion Soul Cleaver onto Lara. And then I'm gonna tap two and I'll put uh, Whisper Silk Cloak back on my commander. Because fuck you, that's why. <laughs> A downsize the shroud. Um, and then. Actually, before I pay for uh, the re-equip, sorry, let me back up. Before I pay for the re-equip, um, that was two. I'm gonna use those two plus these two to play Hammer of Nizan, uh, which I'm going to equip to Ms. Lara Croft uh, for free because whenever it What's or Hammer of what a Hammer of Nizan. Whenever hammer or another equipment enters the battlefield under your control, you may attach that equipment to target creature you control. An equipped creature gets plus two plus zero and has indestructible. Uh, mm. So and then Hold on, wait, hold on. Did you just cast that? I just cast that, yes. Okay. Pause jam. Pause. Let me let me <laughs> let me read this. It 
so you're, you're basically you're about to try and counter it by the way you can't so because of uh, Jamil. Shimmel. Yeah. yeah, I have something for that too, but uh, oh, I just I'm debating because that means you're getting free equipment on on Lara. Well, she's gonna have shroud once Whisper So Cloak goes back on. But yes, when equipments come out, uh, come out, then I can put them on a creature I control for free. Okay, I'll let it resolve. Okay. Um, and then... Um, instead of taking Whisper Silk off of the subterranean schooner, I'm going to keep it on there. So the two that I would have spent to move it, I'm just, obviously I spent that to cast this. That's just going to stay on there. So it is uh, currently unblockable. Um, <clears throat> and then I'm going to hit Electra for three. And Lara is going to explore. She crewed it. Uh, Curiosity, that is going to go on top. Uh, she's going to get a plus one, plus one. Um, <clears throat> and then I will uh, I'll go to my end step and discover five curiosity um, so this is for for McBoom in case he's around or anybody in chat Quib does target but curiosity says enchant creature Whenever enchanted creature does deals damage to an opponent, you may draw a card. It does not say enchant target creature. It just says enchant creature. Can I put this on Lara? Oh, wait, she didn't have the she didn't have shroud. She doesn't have shroud I yet. absolutely could put it on Lara because I'm not paying attention to my own board state. Cool. But I want to know future reference. I f and that was your second card. You Casting an order requires a target. Says Even though it doesn't say the word target, it's it. I guess for that, it is implied. Janitor's target unless you cheat an aura in uh like with Zer. Okay, gotcha. So yes, it would it, you could not enchant something with Shroud. Wait, so what all does Laura have on her? Because she's got I'm uh, uh, vigilance and plus one plus one for every every time a creature dies or an artifact goes to the graveyard. Um she's got um plus two plus zero and indestructible, and then whenever she deals damage to an opponent, uh I draw I could draw a card if I want to. Dang. Gunny, was that your second card draw on his turn? Yes. Well, uh, no, that was the first first card drawn his turn. On his turn, okay. Yes. And how many cards have you drawn? Um, I believe just one. I just play. Okay. I just cast from exile, um, so that was not a draw. So I only drew uh, one time. Uh, okay. Turn. And now I will pass to. Okay, I'm still on your end step, going to flash in very mastermind. So whenever an opponent draws their second card, each turn I will also draw that card. Okay. Draw a card. And then I'll untap. Ooh, I like that one. Each player can draw a card. That'd be fun. <laughs> you should do that. <laughs> then I you don't have to tap it. I mean. Yeah, you should totally pay that you know, for everyone to draw a <laughs> card, Amy. That'd be so cool. <laughs> Temple of the False God. <clears throat> oh, um, I attacked. I need to make a treasure. Sorry. Forgot. Um, we can ask about, like, decks, right? Like, yeah. I can say, like, hey, how many artifacts do you think that you have in that deck, Ben? Uh, how many do I think I have in this deck? Uh, let me do a quick count for you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, uh, da, 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 eighteen, uh, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty, uh, twenty-four, 
Build 24, because I almost got ahead of myself. Uh, 20. Oh. I just reset. Uh, 25, 26, 27. I have 27 artifacts in this deck. Okay. Twenty-eight. Sorry for uh, twenty-nine. Thirty. Oh, you're, oh, sorry. Thirty-one. You're Thirty-two. Thirty-two. Oh, you're good. I just want to give you a correct answer. That's a lot. Um, yeah, that's not uh, counting artifact types within, um, like lands, I'm sideboard, sure creatures, etc. You're not you're not looking at all of them. Cool. So I have thirty-two total. Um. It, not all of those twenty-five are in the deck chat. I. Just trust me, I am correct. Just trust me, guys. Um. Because not all of them are in there. You might not. I don't know if you can see the blue blue check marks or not. I can. That show um, what's actually in the deck. Mm. So. Okay. Uh, I need to combat and I will send uh, actually I'm gonna hold alright I will I think, I, I think I'm gonna pass I'm gonna go to the bathroom I'll be right back <laughs> um, I'm on your end step aims. Do you go down from Lupo for four? I'm going to two. tap enough to activate Brash Taunter. Uh, I'm going to target Laura. Okay. Uh, so what's her power? You said nine? No. <laughs> uh, six. Uh, six? Okay. Yeah. And I'll take that six damage and send it to Electra just to even out the HP a bit. Okay. So she's at 26? Okay. Then my turn. Untap. Upkeep. Wow. Alright. Uh, four damage from what, chat? What are you see. talking about? I don't I didn't I'll do four play damage. A Labyrinth of Scophos. That's how you say it. Uh, I can pay four and tap it to remove attacking or blocking creature from combat. Uh, so that's my land for the turn. Okay. I want to do something that I think would be pretty funny. Um, one, two, and a red. I'm going to play or cast Feather Radiant Arbiter. She's a flying lifelink that uh, whenever I cast a non-creature spell, it targets only Feather Radiant Arbiter. I can choose any... All right, go ahead. She was AFK when you did the you six. Sorry. T t you took six from Brash Taunter uh, fighting my commander and then hitting you for six. And I can't block anything? Yeah, it's just straight damage. Okay. Uh, so I cast a spell that only targets her. Uh, I can choose any number of other targets for that spell and pay two extra mana for each of those creatures. If I do, then each of those creatures uh, will get a copy of that spell. Uh, so then what I'm going to do is uh, tap this for one, two, three, for Vow of Duty, targeting Feather, uh, Rain Arbiter, and then one, two, three, four. Uh, I'll tap four to make two copies of it. One that'll target Laura, and the other one that'll target, um... Uh, target Tegwell. What is targeting Tegwell? He's making uh, a copy of Vow of Duty. Can Vow of Duty? Can he be targeted via Shroud? Oh. Oh, he, uh, does, does he have Shroud from, uh... No, Laura does not have Shroud, but, uh, your, your guy does. Oh, Simon has Shroud. Okay, yeah, yeah. he gives other fairy Shroud. Um... Ooh, uh, then I will target, 
I guess I have to target the Fairy of Una then. Target the Fairy of Una. And so, and and it gets uh plus two plus two has vigilance and it can't attack me or planeswalkers I control. Okay, thank you. Yep. Um then I will I will just uh Pass the turn, I guess. I have nothing else I can do. Okay. I will untap. Um, draw. Mm. Okay. Um, all right. I'm gonna tap. Um, this in play combine a uh, crystallis. Creature tokens you control have flying. Then I am also going to pay... Uh, let's see. One. Two. Three. Um, sacrifice a token. I'm going to sacrifice a Thopter. Um, Dad, I got a fucking play coming up on my turn. You ready? Four, four green beast creature token. Um, That... Oh, wait, no. Uh, that's not right. Never mind. You're good. You're good. You're good. Sorry. Yeah, you're I ready? thought it was a creature for a second. So you're good. Um, so then I would have three tokens. It's not an artifact, though. Um, but yeah. Um, and then one sec. <clears throat> Did you just, you sacked a token? Electra, did you just sack a token, right? Yes. Okay. Laura gets a plus one, plus one. Mm-hmm. Oh, this one, tap. Zach, I um, fucking told you, dude. Oh, so sorry. good. I was trying to do... I'll be able to shout out their YouTube channel, RMTG sub. Uh, films pack openings for RMTG. Um, uh, we don't really do the shout-outs okay, and then kind of thing, you know what I mean? I'm going to tap. Uh, it says tap two untapped artifacts you control target creature can't be blocked this turn mm -hmm. um i'm gonna have uh i'm gonna put that to gimbal um okay is the, who can i not attack because i'm so confused of like the whole shroud and all of that other stuff like okay. i don't know so what can't be attacked and shroud just means a creature cannot be targeted at all by anybody so okay. you can not, attack not in combat yeah by like a spell yeah by a spell okay that yeah. makes sense but i think it says target creature you can't do that to it uh, but otherwise uh does is anything that electra has goaded by you in any way gunny uh, I believe the phoenix is the phoenix is is because it's because it's was brought back by you right yes it's when it's until your enchantment leaves so I can't uh, attack you with the phoenix it's until the the yeah, it's just as long uh, as it's out so the duty counter yeah he, he cast a mortal obligation it put a counter mm -hmm. on that guy um and for as long as the counter's on it which will be until it dies it's goaded it can't attack gunny and it can't block gunny okay um, as far as my board state, I have three blockers, and if any of my fairies die, uh, or any of my creatures die, Grey Pack will trigger, and everyone will have to sacrifice a creature. Okay. Um, and then Ben, what about yours? I, Sorry, I, I know I ask every time, it's just it changes, what do you need and to know I about get overwhelmed. Mine? Well, of like... I don't have any blockers just, like, right now. You have no blockers right yeah, now? Yeah, um, I, I can't block you. Okay. Um, okay, I'm going to send Gimbal at Gunny, and he can't be blocked, so that's four commander. Mm-hmm. And uh, then... Windborn Muse, I think, right? Yeah, you have to oh, yeah, tap you, you two. You have to pay two mana if you want to attack me. Oh, sure. She Why not? paid the mana. She paid the tax. I don't pay the mana. Good. Don't tell You're me not a I magic player. Do. You pay the taxes. How dare you? I <laughs> pay my taxes, and pay you will magic. take four. <laughs> Um, 
And then you have no. Wait, yeah, you have one flying. She has two flyers. You have two flyers. Uh, she is a six-five uh, flying lifelink. Oh, okay. Um, and then Ben. What's up? Hey, bud. How's it going? Pretty good. Oh wait, real quick, Ash. I think that means that he can kill Gimbal, Gimbal if he swings. No. Uh, she made him unblockable. Yeah, he's unblockable server. this round. Oh. Because I, I tapped this. Uh, oh wait, no, no, I don't have to tap that. You it's, tapped the I two tapped other artifacts. These yeah. artifacts to make him unblockable, so I could hit Gunny. Sorry, oh, gotcha, gotcha. That's cool. Um. All right, Ben. I'm gonna send. Hit me. Push I me win. The first. I'm gonna send. Do it. Eight at you. Oi. Bloody Boy. what now? You sending fucking eight at me? Well, send. And actually, you know what? I'm yes. gonna keep one of them up. I'll send six at you. That's absolutely um, unbelievable. I don't think the beast can attack because you 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 summoned it this turn, right? Oi! You sacked. You That's sacked right. The yeah. I'll still send six, but it'll be something different. Different six at me then. <laughs> yeah, Is different it all six. Flying? You know what? It will actually be eight. Yeah, every all, all of right, mine now, are flying. All right, now we're really <laughs> pissing me off right now. So we're sending <laughs> you got eight. All right, I'm, I'm down to, to seventeen. I'm gonna remember this, eh? Right? Fuck. That's right, fuck. Yeah, I can't Fact. believe she's attacking me like that. Jeez, the nerves. Yeah, no blockers. I'm trying to be more confident in my attack. Oh, it's good. You did the right thing. I will not feel you bad. Did, I will the right not thing. feel bad. You did the right thing. Yeah, I know. I know. I did. I know. I did. You did the, hey, um, hey, you did the right thing. <laughs> what about it? You did the right thing. Okay, I'm gonna create um a red gremlin. That's a three three. Um, yeah, and then and he's also flying, and then I'm gonna you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pass my freaking turn. Sick. Let's Sick. fucking go! Woohoo! Untap ski, upkeep ski, and draw ski. Ooh wee! All right, let's do some stupid shit, shall we? Uh, let's do one, two, uh, three, and four. Uh, one of which is red to put out. Duretti, Scrap Savant. He is a planeswalker. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Hold on, I gotta put his thing out here. He's How do you spell three. his name? Oh, got Duretti. him. Duretti. Duretti. Okay. Um, then, so he's at three. Then I'm gonna tap one red. I'm gonna play Gamble. Search your library for a card. Put that card into your hand. Discard a card at random, then shuffle. I'm gonna draw a card off of Trouble in Paris, who has your second spell. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna have to double check a, a rule in a second, but I'm pretty sure I'm doing this the right way. Uh, Gamble does not have a reveal, right? No, it does not. Cool. Sh I'm shuffling, sorry. Okay. Um, all right. At random, Amy, left or right? Right. Right? Goes into yeah. goes into the graveyard? Yeah. It is Sir Ginger. <laughs> He's cute. Sad. I'll miss you, little friend. That's okay, though. Um, okay. Next, we will... Let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, perfect. Uh, one, two... Three, four, five, six, uh, to sack the treasures, to play Mycosynth Lattice. All permanents are artifacts in addition to their other types. All cards that aren't on the battlefield, spells, and permanents are colorless, and players may spend mana as though it were mana of any color. 
Everything you have is now an artifact, Electra. In response. Huh? <laughs> in response. I I've. I mean, okay. I. I want to walk through this because I. I still learn too, right? Like. Yep. I. Okay. I don't like playing blue. It's not my favorite. Good. There's a reason I don't really play it. Because I hate counterspelling. I hold on to them the entire game. Yep. And I never spend them. I have quite a few. <laughs> um. This is one of those moments, though, where I feel like I should counterspell. You can't. Yeah, sadly you can't. So oh, Chamil's still, still out here. Chamil. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Would that be no, wait non land permanence? Wait, what card is that? Sorry. Uh, Mycosynth lattice. It is all permanents are artifacts in addition to their other types. M Y C O S Y N T H. M Y C. C. Yep. C. C. Okay. So everything is artifacts except everything's colorless. What is artifacts? Um, all permanents are artifacts in addition to... So even types. lands? Yep. Yep. Do you have Vandal Blast in there? In this deck? Absolutely not. Why would I blow my own shit up? I just didn't know. Sometimes no. you, that's no, like no, a no. win con for people. Do you have the Reaver Cleaver in that deck? Um, it is in the deck list, but it is not currently in the deck because I do not own oh. one yet. to put it in the graveyard oh from the battlefield never mind no he, he doesn't he's he's dead chat what you got amy oh no i said you're good oh I'm, it, it resolves i'm i'm set mm, i mean i can't counterspell it okay just making sure um i am going to go to combat um electra yeah. How's it going? Pretty good. Yeah, you doing all right? Yeah. Please don't kill me. I'm not gonna kill you. I can't. I can't kill you. Okay. Um, I don't want to hit Gunny. If I hit Gunny, he blocks with Brash Taunter and hits me a bunch. If I attack Amy, that's just bad all around in general. Well, uh, don't forget, I gave Laura a vow of duty. Again, every time you pronounce her name wrong, she wants to hit you harder, Gunny. Laura. 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 Laura Croft. Lara Not Laura Croft. Croft. Laura. 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 She will She will cut your throat in your sleep. In game. Um, Electra, <laughs> I have to attack you. Okay. She is a 9-8 vigilance and indestructible. Is that with the plus? That's with the plus two, plus two, right? Yes, I have that account. So you could chump block if you wanted. Wait, sorry, what? Sorry, I'm attacking you, you with saying? a nine eight. With anything? Uh, it has death touch. Uh, it has death touch, mm. vigilance, and indestructible. So mm. you, you just chump block with one uh, one one. strike. Oh, where's it getting first strike from? Is that Bow Duty gives it first strike? No, she just has that base. Oh, yeah, she got first strike at reach, but I mean, like, yeah. She's just fucking swinging for the rafters, dude. Um, I'm actually gonna block with this one. That guy's tapped. Oh. Well. Because you wanna, I, I see why you wanna do it. You either have to get rid of the 3 3 if you're gonna keep one, uh, different names, or you have to get, or get rid of the 1 1 if you just wanna chop block. Small. I'll get. I'll get rid of the 3-3, three, three, just because I want the token. Still, if I get rid of my Thopter, then I have to get rid of a token. Uh, it's going to go to 5 now, because the thing died. When she attacks in the exile, target legendary artifact, or legendary land card from the graveyard, and put a uh, discovery counter. Because all permanents are artifacts currently, I'm going to put Lord High, uh, Urza, Lord High Artificer, over here, so he is now playable, um, as long as he has a discovery counter on him so i'll just do that uh because he is a uh an artifact now um and then i will 
go to actually i'm going to do his uh top power but i'm going to discard nothing uh so that'll just go up and then i'm going to discover five uh hellkite tyrant that's tragic uh palantir will uh hit the board hellkite tyrant goes to the bottom that was that's my fucking win con card <laughs> damn it <laughs> Dang. Wait, uh, what is it called? I want to look at it. Hellkite Tyrant. Uh, if during my upkeep I have 20 artifacts, uh, then I win the game. Dang. And since everything on the board right now is artifacts. Is artifacts. That's pretty cool. That is cool. I was curious. I was wondering why you had the micro sent to. Yep. I, I was like, if it's not a Vandal win con, then like, what is it? That makes sense. Uh, if you want to look this card up, uh, Electra, because it's the it's the poster art from Lord of the Rings. That looks so cool. Uh, but it's if you just type in Palantir, you will find it. Uh, it's at the beginning of your end step, put an influence counter on it and scry two, and target opponent may have you draw a card. If that player doesn't, I mill X, where X is the number of influence counters on Palantir, and that player loses life equal to their mana value. Oh my God. So that's going to be fun. Fun. Um, And I will... How many cards do you draw this turn? Um, I, let's see, I drew, I drew one. Okay. I drew one. Just making sure. So if you want to make us each draw a card, then you would. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So everyone draws a card because y'all drew. We get two? We have. You, it... you get one, I get two. Is it a May and then you get something from it or do we just get to draw a card? Each player draw, draws a card. When an opponent draws their second card each turn, oh. you draw a card. Uh, oh, so wait, I'm supposed to draw. I'm supposed to draw one, right? Yes. Yeah, so okay. she paid the four for each player draws a card. Yeah, and then Ames will draw two: one for Ben and one for me. Yep. And then on top of so each it's player, so it's three. Yeah. Yes. There you go. Electra, are you excited for your end step? Yeah. It's gonna go fucking crazy. You're gonna have a lot no. of little bastards out. Wait, no, because... Oh, you're going to make wait, one it, big bastard, then. I make... Well, no, because it's... Are they artifact tokens? Because it specifically has oh, to be an artifact creature artifact token, token. So, yeah, token. I can't yeah. make one oh, that's big. Oh, get shit yeah. on. Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> it's okay. Sorry. <laughs> well, that's why I wanted to sacrifice the red gremlin, so I had yeah. one, two, three, so that it can still be another three, three gremlin. Yep. Like, I'll make another one. I missed the fucking token on that. Damn, if it was just differently named... Artifacts? Yeah, that would oh, that would be shit. wild. Oh my god, I'd make so many, so many guys. Hmm. Mm. Well, I attacked this turn. I attacked uh, Electra, so I get a treasure token getting that sorry play una una i can pay into x choose a color target opponent exiles top x cards of their library for each card of the chosen color exile this way create a one one blue black fairy rogue creature token with flying does that mean everything in the game is colorless uh let me see the card again this is for una yeah choose a color yeah everybody everything's colorless <laughs> So and, it'll be zero. She can choose color as, as or colorless as a color. Uh, uh, uh. You cannot choose colorless as a color. Oh, you can't. No. Colorless is is literally no color. Oh, then can I not play her? Because yeah, I thought that meant you can take I it could. back. Yeah, yeah, you can take it back. Yeah, you. So it it's colorless is lack of color, and since you're voice forced to choose a color, you're fucked. That bottom right, ability doesn't you. do anything for that. I am happy with what this deck has done so far. Um <laughs> I I am happy with it. I don't know. It is fun. I I like what this has done. Your angels is six, six, right, Gunny? Uh, six, five. Five. Okay. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, I'll play this Shadow Puppeteer. It is a 4-4 four, four with flying in Ward 2. Whenever it ETBs, create two 1-1 one, one Black Fairy Rogue Creature Tokens with flying. And then whenever a creature you control with flying attacks, I can have its base... Or I may be ha have it become a Red Dragon with base power and toughness 4-4 four, four, in addition to its other color and types until the end of turn. Mitchell doesn't have Trample. Um... I think I have a reason here. Oh, oh, Bowie. Bowie. Wait, I'm sorry. I was talking. What happened? I'm uh, sorry. I play Shadow Puppeteers, so I'm basically... That sounds scary. Uh, <laughs> my stuff can become <laughs> dragons. <gasps> yeah, no, not yeah, the scary. dragons. No, it's scary. All the dragons. Dragons. I do. Oh, God. All your stuff? Is now drag are now dragons? Um, I can have them become a dragon with base power four four until the end of turn. Um, with drag yeah flying. Legit, Denny, is it a VR game Creatures or a mobile game? Flying, so they had to have flying. <coughs> they or is it gray zone warfare? Dragons. It's one of those four, three four, things. But they are it? still fairies, so they also get the plus ones. So they will be like six six. Um, cool. And these are. One, one. Cool. Right. Yeah, cool. I, I already know. Move to combat. And I have to attack with this one. I think it's goaded. Uh, it no, it, it, it just it just can't attack me or, or planeswalkers I control. Oh. Yeah. It has vigilance? plus two, plus two in vigilance, yes. Uh, what flyers do you have, Ash? What'd you say, sorry? What flyers do you have? Um, a one, one, and a four, four. Okay, I'm gonna send Ona at you. She is a five, five with flying. I'm going to send Fairy Mastermind and have it, I'm gonna have it become the four, four dragon. It's gonna get plus two, plus two, so it's gonna be a six, six dragon. And do you have flyers? I have Actually, reach. no. I'm gonna send this to Gunny. Um, uh, I'll block with my. Sorry, are you done? Yes. Okay, I'll block with my thought and we'll die. Okay. All right. Um. Oh, do you pay the two to attack me? By the way. Um. The, the, the muse. Yeah, I'll pay two. All right. Um, I'm gonna be straight up with you. <clears throat> I Last will... round, I have thing going on. I don't have a lot going on right now. So you're saying what? Six, six, I mean, you said. Yeah. I'll. Yeah. Did something die? I'll, I'll trigger the gate, the grade pact. Yeah. Um, I'll block with my six five life link. All right, mastermind will die. Trigger grade pack. Everybody sacrifices a creature. So one, two. Oh, I just sacked. Um, do you have to sacrifice two, Amy, or is it just opponent sack, right? Uh, it's just opponents, right? It's opponents, but I do lose a life and draw a card for the tag will trigger. Gonna use sacked a thing, right? Yep, I sacked the windborn use. That's gonna go up. Electra's gonna sack a thing. It's gonna go up. That um, was the token. Okay, subterranean schooner is gonna uh, get crewed by Lara, and then I'm gonna sack subterranean schooner because it becomes a creature. It's gonna die. Yep. And it goes up. Cool. Um, cool. I have to discard down the hand size, I believe. And did I play my land for turn? I don't remember. Fuck. I, I don't, don't think you did. I don't think I did. I don't think I did. I might have chat checked the bot, but I don't believe I did. I'm play a swamp. And if they Lars a fucking it, 15 14 it, right now. So I'll discard this. <coughs> She's One, a 15 two, three, fucking four, 14 five, right now. Six, can't seven, attack Gunny. Eight, I'll discard. But I can punch a... somebody with her. 
I'm gonna get Urza back out, which means I'm gonna get my uh, little dude back out. All right. And so long as Micah's and Lattice is still on the board, we're in we're in the fucking money, dude. Yeah, upkeep and blah. Lars thick as fuck. She's indestructible though, so it's it's sacrifices, exiles, or one I ones. Think That's it. I'm just gonna go try and speed things up here. Tapping for two. Three, four, five, six. <clears throat> Attempt to cast a spell called Fiendish Duo. Yeah, <laughs> that's the double damage one. Um, oh, I hate that one. I hate that one. What is Lara right now? She is a uh, 15, 14. Oh. So that would be 30 commander if she hits you. Yeah, we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> do a thing, Amy. Do your thing. Gunny. Go, Amy, go. I think we got to counter spell that one, yeah. Uh, how big is how big is she? Do you say, Laura? Yeah, she's a fifteen fourteen right now. That can't attack um, you, Gunny. With that on the stack, I will one, two, three. I'll tap the brash taunter, have a fight Laura, and hit Amy in the face for fifteen damage. <gasps> in response, I'm gonna deadly rally brash taunter. Let's go! Is that exile? Yeah, he's yeah. gone! Yeah, it's exile. <laughs> Fresh Chandra is a very good card. Yeah, he's scary. Here comes the follow-up red, white counterspell. Uh, uh, Deadly Rollick is what she casts. Do... That's a good fucking, that was a good fucking move, dude. Uh, well, that was your second card for this turn. It so was. I will... Uh, yeah, because she counterspelled and cast Deadly Yeah, Rollick. I said it It was, yeah. as in, yes, you were correct. Did you just draw a, a second card for turn? I did, actually. Uh, I think that card actually of mine died. I did. Yeah, I, I, I got rid of it. Um, yeah, I I have nothing. Dude, that Where's was a gone? solid fucking combo there. Yeah, that was crazy. I've that been was holding <laughs> on to these since turn two. Jeez. <laughs> Um, Good shit. let's see. All right, so then this also gets counterspelled. Yeah, Fiendish Duo uh, gets uh, counterspelled, so it's gone. Um, let's see. All your fairies still have, aside from that one, still have the thing, right, Shroud? Yeah. Yes. Talking about her stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I haven't played a land for the turn. Oh, creatures just hit the graveyard. Wait, two creatures just hit the graveyard. No, not from the battlefield. Only one from the battlefield. Never mind. Yeah. Five. Cool. Got it. Uh, land for the turn is a mountain. Uh, let's see. <coughs> cool. What do I have in here that can... Lara's fucking... Th Dicky, dude. She big girl right now. She, uh, fucking. Uh, 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 <sighs> Doesn't even start as a 2 2 counter. Ow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight. Um, yeah, I'll just, um, I will pass the turn, discard the hand size, I'll discard War Room, and I will pass the turn. Or is still, or is okay. still on her. Yeah, it's still there. It didn't go away. I'll draw. Um, did your aura die? Uh, no, it's still on there. Okay. Because that's a copy of it. Yeah, it's a copy of it. So. I'm gonna, okay, so I'm gonna do a thing, and I think I understand what's gonna happen, but if I'm wrong, please tell me. Okay. Um. Send it, bud. 
<laughs> I'm gonna try. I feel like I'm about to do something really cool, but I don't know. We'll see if I'm doing it wrong. Um, okay, first thing I'm gonna do uh, is tap one blue and then three colorless and play Vidalcan Humiliator. Uh, when he attacks, you can, uh, if you control three or more artifacts, I control 19 currently. <laughs> um, <laughs> creatures your opponent control lose all abilities and have base power and toughness of 1-1 one, one until the end of turn. Oh, damn. Um, and then... <laughs> I, oh, I can't give it haste. Damn. Okay. <laughs> Shit. And then I'm going to tap this in order to play a card. But before I play it, I'm also going to do an... O okay, when I'm if I'm overloading this, I'm just playing pay the it overload and then overloading. Cost. You just, play, okay. just only pay the overload cost. Not... I don't have no, to you pay don't pay to the play top. This. You don't pay the top. You just pay the overload cost. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so that's two colorless... Two blue... And then two more colorless. And I will play Rise and Shine. Target non-creature artifacts. Oh, wait, that actually changes to each. Each non-creature artifact uh, <laughs> that you control becomes a basically 4-4. Four, four. So... <laughs> Thank you, Ben. Got you, bud. Don't hit me. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> um, okay. So non-creature artifacts so that that's would be all one, your lands all your lands two three four well, so the stuff that's five, tapped won't six, matter for attacking seven, right now eight, nine ten eleven twelve thirteen well they're, well, actually, they're gonna have somebody sickness it's anyways permanent yeah so uh the lands shouldn't and the the uh, land shouldn't anything what, have some wait Any, yeah anything that you had on the battlefield prior to your turn yeah can attack it doesn't have summoning sickness yeah, so this the... McBoom, okay. do they lose their other card types? And the Because it doesn't... Usually can, it specifies uh, that attack. they keep their other card types. Yeah, so... Do they just become creatures? This is a 4-4. Four, four. Also, everything has trample because of Gimbal. So this is a 4-4, 4-4, 4-4, 4-4. This one's a 4-4. Four, four. Four, 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 four. <laughs> this one's a 4-4. Four, four. This one's a four, four. Well, all of these are, but they can't <laughs> I feel like I, did I do something cool? Did I do that right? 100% yeah. you did. Really cool with my yeah. 100% you did. Woohoo! You end up upgrading this deck, Micro, since it's a good card to add to it. Yeah. Okay. Um. Now I'm overwhelmed, though. <laughs> um. Okay. Um, something yeah. I want to point out, mm -hmm. and I'm double checking on this. But because the text of the card, Rise and Shine, does not specify that it keeps its previous types, all of your lands cannot be tapped for mana anymore. They are now all zero, zero, zero artifact creatures. Mm. They're all four fours, I think. I'm double checking because typically they say in Got addition it. to their other types, and that one just says it becomes a artifact creature. Mm-hmm. Okay. But that's just for this turn. So that's no, fine, that's permanent. No, that's, that's permanent. They become permanently. Yeah, yeah, there's no until end of turn. They literally, all of her lands are now artifacts and she has no mana left. Target non-creature artifact. <laughs> yeah, oh, that okay. Makes sense. Uh, so I'm, um, nope, I'm double checking. Uh, apparently, if anything becomes an artifact creature, rule 205.1b, <laughs> some okay, effects state okay. that an object becomes a, quote, artifact creature. These effects allow this object to retain all of its prior card types and subtypes. It is a specific yeah! rule that is insinuated when you make it into an artifact creature that includes in the rules that it does retain its previous card types. All right. That's the first time I've ever seen that. I know the exact fucking Yay! rule line. 207.1b. 207.1b. Holy shit. All right. You asked to see Gimbal. Yeah, yeah do this. Write that down. <laughs> write that down, write that down. Write that down, write that down. That's cool. Um, yeah. 
Also, um, you just got fucking juice to the sky. <laughs> Thanks, man. Well, and whenever, oh my god, it took. Oh, you have no idea. It took everything in me Wait. when you when you were like, oh, you're gonna get to juice that guy, blah blah blah, whatever. And I was like, oh, but I'm not gonna have that. You're like, oh, that sucks. What? And I was like, wait till he figures it out. What's up, Amy? But oh, never mind. I thought the uh, was she, she. You have notes like I take notes in the bottom mm -hmm. right. I thought you were saying that in addition to that, you had 19 like treasure tokens or something and i was like no no, no. fucking dead but okay <laughs> I was trying, okay but i also didn't see that it said like non-creature so like this one this one this yeah, wait, no, creatures this one, all stay the same these stay the same oh but this is a artifact creature token so what happens it's, with this it's still an still artifact creature. creature so it's yeah it's still a creature so you're just looking at your non-creature okay. artifacts which is all of your non-creature things on the board mm. this one still has flying because of this yep. this is a flyer and I think that's the only one because I sacrificed the other ones because I couldn't block with. Yeah. Um. Okay. I'm overwhelmed. I did a cool thing and I you didn't. Did a super and, cool thing. and then and then I didn't think about what I was gonna do after. That. Yeah. Like, cool. uh, question. Question. How many? Yeah. Uh, how many? She could kill me right now. Lanes you have on tap right now? She. Yeah. Gunny's about to tell her. Watch this. Ready? Four lands untapped. Four lands untapped. Okay, so that's one, two. So, and you don't have any blockers, right? I just want to point out, Gunny doesn't have yeah. any blockers. I don't have any blockers. Oh. See, so at least not oh, on the board there, currently. There is a way you can hit aims for uh, for some damage right now if you want to. Yeah, but you guys don't have any blockers. Hey, Gunny, of course we're gonna try and deflect, dude. <laughs> Well, I mean, of course. Uh, uh, what, you know. <laughs> Let me just drop this little tidbit here. Since all your permanents are now artifacts, do you know who can tap artifacts to make creatures unblockable? No. You've got your a guy. You've got a guy. Uh, Whirler Rogue. You can tap two untapped artifacts, which can be your lands. You can tap two of them and make oh, your creatures true, unblockable. Oh, true. They can't be blocked. So to Gunny's point, if you you technically can hit anybody you want to right now gunny also has 30 hp gunny does have 30 hp i do 100 uh, yeah. percent agree with that <laughs> don't forget your phoenix does have to attack me or amy okay but you could make it unblockable so by what is artifact. what it can uh, what is the card that's giving unblockable or whatever whirler can you just whirler rogue in the top left yeah uh, whirler uh, rogue. The, the bottom part is she could tap two untapped uh, artifacts I tap two untapped artifacts and so everything's an artifact so if i tap two i can make something unblockable oh but then you would be taking away from but i take two, your I, yeah 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 attackers yeah mm -hmm. uh, then yeah i mean you could do that <laughs> you could hit me or you can hit Gunny. I'll just make everyone sacrifice. Oh, yeah, no, or, or you can hit Aims. Yeah, just make, make them the block one Aims. Oh, God. Or I can hit Ben. I, he doesn't have a block Hey, either. just so long as I'm not getting hit, I don't give a fuck what you do. <laughs> I'm at 17. I'm chilling right now. Yeah, but you say that, and then you're going to pull some has shit out of your ass. And then... <laughs> I'm a fat ass commander. It is true, all right? Dude, Laura's been hitting the gym. Commander. The triangle titties are popping commander. off, y'all. Okay? Er Sideboarded Urza right now, and how many cards are in your hand? Just one. Oh, okay. I'm just saying. Ugh. It's a It's a choice. Ash, you choose, dude. You choose what you okay, want to choose. Let's see how much damage all together I have. Let's see. Oh, well, that was your second card you cast, and so I'm gonna fuck her. 16, 20, 24. <laughs> you have Plus, If you kill me, Electra, then you lose Microsynth Lattice and all your artifacts go away. Yeah. I'm important to you. So just kill Gunny. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just do that. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, just be look at the hand that I've been dealt. I I just wanted. I feel like I did something cool and I need to do something with it. So the fact that these are untapped, like they don't have summoning sickness. Okay, so four. <laughs> Sorry, you can still stunning. knock someone down though and not kill them. That's true. Because they okay, could fine. still be a threat, including myself. How would I um, target you though? Because you have. A bunch of flyers. The only way you could do damage to my HP is if you take away some of your attackers by tapping them to tap my stuff. Um, and there will still, pr I still have five blockers, so I, I will still end up probably blocking stuff. 
Um, if we, you could probably do the math to see if any of my stuff lives through your attacks, but then it would be pointless attacking. I would make gray pack triggers. I would probably block to have my stuff die. Mm -hmm. And then I would make everyone start sacrificing creatures. Question with, okay, just uh, with this card, everything. Wait, so non creature artifacts. Okay, never mind, never mind. Yeah. I didn't know whether or not Never these also got put that plus sorcery plus into uh, the graveyard because it has been cast. Okay. Wait, so this doesn't count as an... No, it's not an enchantment. It just goes... Well, you just I cast it and it goes... I casted through. it, but can I... Can I not... Does it not count as it's a, a... It's a sorcery, so it goes It's not the a graveyard. permanent. Yeah, it's not okay, a permanent. Yeah. Um... I'm going to send... Twenty at Gunny. So this is wait four eight twelve. Yeah, yeah. Twenty at Gunny, and then uh, mm, then Ben, I'm gonna hit you for eight. Okay and then leave three blockers. Uh, don't forget your Phoenix has to attack. Oh wait, no, it doesn't. It's, oh, wait. It, no, it, it, it still has the duty count. It but, uh, the um, count yeah, it is goaded. Yeah, so the Phoenix has to attack. And so Amy, what do you have? What's your biggest blocker? Sorry. My biggest blocker? Mm -hmm. Um, I have a five, five. Uh, and another five, five. Actually a six, six. This is a six, six. Yeah, fire. You could also wait. Is Vidalkin humiliator? Does he have summoning sickness? Yes. Damn it. Okay, never mind. Could I still tap him though? Uh, he has to attack. Uh, yeah. Uh, you, you can tap him to yeah, but the. I can tap oh, you, yes, you can. For this, yes, you can. Right? Yes, you can. Yep. Okay. Yep. So what? I, my thinking is like I want to make sure that I have blockers still. Okay. So I already sent. If you're 20 sending to, twenty I'm to send, Gunny, I'm those sending five. Twenty to Gunny. Yep. Okay, since he has summoning sickness, I'll just tap him and I'll tap. Um, this guy. Ryan, it's called spell and then table. Amy, thing. I'm sending four unblockable to you. Okay. Um, since you are attacking with two more creatures, I get to draw a card. Can I draw a card? No. <laughs> okay. And then, um, did you hit me for anything, Watra? Um, I don't think so. Just because I might as well. You tap those two guys to make that unblockable. This, yes. Like okay. Because I can't do much like with him or whatever. So. Yep. Yeah. And then don't forget to tap your phoenix because he does good not have vigilance. or not, but whatever. Before combat damage, I'm gonna tap one of my planes. I was gonna say your soul snare or something. Sacrifice soul snare. Uh, I'll hit the command tower that's attacking me. <laughs> Your command tower gets exiled. Okay. Yeah, white exiling lands. Yeah. So I'll, I'll take 15. Okay. Wait, Still 15? hurts. You yeah, 16? Yeah, 16, Gunny. Six. Oh, 16? No, yeah. Sorry. Cool. Woohoo! Fun things. That's silly so silly that was fun you got a lot of scary shit out there that's gonna be a problem bud <sighs> all right uh, are you done Electra? yeah i guess all righty you're gonna kill me i might have to no we'll see I don't, I, it's depends. one of those moments where it Ash, like it's like I a should have fucking like, killed him. Yeah, it's one of those things where it's God, like, why am I too nice? It doesn't even have to be Ben. It could have been. No, like, I'm always too nice. I do the same thing. I leave people open, then I die my next turn. It's just something you you uh, learn over playing more often. In response to uh, your end step, Electra, uh, I wanted to make sure this is out there. I'm gonna uh, draw a card, which I just did, and then I'm gonna discard a card, and put down uh, that one, and then it'll untap at the beginning of my turn. Okay, I also have to make a red gremlin. That's a two, two with flying. Because of gimbal. Okay. 
Okay. Um, let's see. Two blue. Uh, and two others to... Oh, wait. I can't do that. Can't do that until I attack. I have to attack with Ms. Lara first. Two, three. Hmm. Just checking real quick. Up. I should have kept that in there. Oh well. I can I can still figure something out here, maybe. That'll go there, that'll go there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That. Is it Teamer or Timmer? I think it's Teamer. Teamer? Yeah, I think so. Teamer. Uh, I'm going to tap this and draw a card. That's my second card draw of the turn. Damn. Um, and I will discard uh, Defense of the Heart. Um, actually, I'm not going to discard Defense of the Heart. Just kidding. Back it up. Back it up. Guys, back, back, it up. Up. back it the fuck up. I'm going to discard uh, Dark Steel Monolith. Uh, and then I'm going to do the minus two ability here to go down to three. I'm going to sacrifice this treasure token because I sack an artifact. And I'm going to return an artifact from my graveyard to the battlefield. Uh, so Dark Steel Monolith is going to uh, enter the battlefield. Uh, once per turn, I can cast a. I can uh, pay zero rather than pay the mana cost for a color spell you cast from your hand. I'm gonna cast the Immortal Sun for free. Uh, players can't activate Planeswalker loyalty abilities. At the beginning of my draw step, I draw an additional card. Spells I cast cost one less to cast and creatures I control get plus one, plus one. Um, I'm going to tap, uh, let's see here. One green, two, three, cost one less. So I'll play Defense of the Heart now, uh, which is the beginning of my upkeep. Uh, if opponent controls three more creatures, um, sack defense of the heart and I get two creatures from my uh, library on the battlefield for free I'm going to draw a card from that your second spell yes sir um, I'll let you at 26 Amy you're at 18 11 oh uh, I sacked a treasure <laughs> token so this goes up there we go. it's 12 15, 16, 17, uh, plus one from Immortal Sun is 18. Uh, I'm going to tap one, two, three. I'm going to put Whisper Silk Cloak onto my commander. Um, and then I'm going to attack Amy for 12, uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, unblockable. Unblockable. Yep. GG's. Ooh. Oh, my God. Um, oh, I forgot to do fucking Palantir. Dang. Um, beginning your end, oh, no, that's end step. Just kidding. Never mind. We're good. I've got two land left. Another mana to... All right. Um, I'm going to... go. Oh, uh, she attacked. Oh, wait. She attacked. I make a treasure token. Cool. I also. Um, what's up? I have a question. Okay, someone in my chat made a good point of like, okay, because I did this sorcery, 
it automatically, because of the sorcery, it made everything a 4-4. Four, four. So they would stay a 4-4. Four, four. Uh, yes, there's still 4-4s four, right now. I should have killed you because regardless if that card goes away, there's still 4-4s four, because the sorcery yeah, we, made we it so. Yeah, we did all that. Well, but I, I was confused because you said, it, well, if my stuff goes away, then that goes away. Yeah, but so if, if Michael Synth true, Lattice right? goes away, if I di I'm saying if I die, then none of your stuff is artifacts anymore. But the sorcery... Oh, that would make them an artifact. Yeah, the yeah, you're correct. The sorcery would make it an artifact no matter what. So even if you died, they would stay 4-4s, four Yes, correct? yeah, you're actually correct. Okay, I didn't realize that until now, but yep. that makes sense for future stuff. Um. Okay. So uh, the, the trigger goes off. So she's... Uh, I make the treasure um, and put I put Bloom Tender over there. Um, I'm during my second main. I'm gonna tap one, two, and sack the treasure to get Urza back from exile. Uh, when he ETBs, I make a construct uh, with plus one plus one for each artifact to control. I'll check that here. I'll check that now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, uh, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3. He is a 23, 23 currently. I'm just going to do like that. It's 23. Ten, or, uh, tens and ones. Uh, I'll get actual counters in a second. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, fuck. Fuck yeah, dude. Okay. Um, second main is still going on. I am going to... Uh, now I can tap untapped artifacts control for one uh, blue. So I'm going to tap one, two, uh, three, four, uh, fucking five. I'm going to tap these five over here to shuffle my library, then exile the top card. Oh, I sacked a treasure too. Laura goes up another So I'm shuffling. Okay. Uh, to uh, exile the top card until end of turn, uh, you may play that card without paying its mana cost. Uh, I'll go ahead and play that legendary enchantment. That's fine. Uh, that goes Which, one? There. Which one's that? Uh, that is Heart of the Explorer or uh, Search for Azcanta. If you begin your upkeep, oh. surveil one. If you have seven or more cards in your graveyard, uh, you may transform it into the other side. Um, okay. And then we're going to go ahead and I'll tap one, two, three, four, five right here for blue. And I'm going to do that again. This is now a 24. Shuffling. I just made this fucking shit up tonight, by the way. It's doing pretty fucking well. It's doing pretty well, yeah. I don't think I win yeah, this because awesome. of Electra, but we'll see. Uh, as foretold, anime mommy as foretold. Um, Ooh, nice. That's going to go out over there. Uh, da, 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 da. I need a way. I can't do that right now. I don't think I can. I've got one two, three, four, oh, five, I think. I tap, wait, one. Isn't your Planeswalker two, also four. a... Uh... Yeah, that's the four. I guess I could do Urza, but then I lose a blocker. I, I, I'm pretty sure Electra's about to kill me no matter what. Cause I, I can't get a board wipe out to take care of her. What about the bow? You can tap the bow, can't you? Yeah, so one, two, three, four is what I'm saying. I need a fifth one. If I do oh, those. okay. So, okay. yeah, I... I don't think I can squeeze out another one of those right now, which is fine. Um, and I can only tap those for blues. Okay, so I will go to my end step. Uh, I'll do Palantir of Orthanc first. Chat. Uh, uh, McBoom, I already tapped it, dude. I already tapped that. Chat, I'm, I, I got it. Daddy's in, Daddy's in, in control. Begin your step, put an influence counter on it. 
Uh, okay, let me get an influence counter. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Oop. Um, then target opponent may have you draw a card. Um, Electra, you want me to draw a card? If you don't, I will mill X cards where X is the number of influence counters, just one, and you will lose life equal to the total mana value of those. Uh, if oh, I've just scried. I've just scried too. Yeah, sorry. Um, okay, uh, I'll put those both back on top. Now you choose. Do you have me? Do you want me to draw a card or not? Wait, but if you if, if, you, if you choose to not have me draw a card, I will mill the number of counters here one, and you'll take damage equal to the total mana value of those cards. So you either sure. risk taking damage. You want me to? You want me to draw a card? Yeah, sure. Why not? That'll be fun. Wait, which one? Yeah, you just just mill one and then I'll oh, take whatever damage. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fun. Uh, it is Zuladoc, take oh. six. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're still going to kill my ass. Um, <laughs> so that's that one. And then I have another end step donut. Oh, yeah, in, in here. Uh, that's beginning of my upkeep. Uh, let's draw a step. Uh, that's not it. That's not it. Uh, it is this one. Uh, discover five. Uh, chromatic lantern enters the battlefield. I will recount my, uh, shit here in a second. Oh, actually, hold on. Wait. Um, these are all Holding. tapped. Still, we're not, I just realized we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Uh, I'm going to tap one here. Oh, that has to, because it's ability... It is not colorless. I can't do Grim Whisper, but I can tap these two and get. Uh, oh wait, no, I can only do one per turn. Never mind. Backing up. Still learning the deck. Still learning the deck. I am actually no done. Gunny, you're up. All right. All right. I can only do that once. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Did All I right. discover five yet? Uh, the Chromatic Lantern. Oh, yes. That's right. Thank you. Yes. Uh, play the planes for the turn. Uh, how much mana do I have? I have four, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Three. Yeah, just remember everything over here is dead. Just or is tapped. Everything is tapped over here. Tap for one. I'm sitting on I'm sitting on five Actually, things that I could tap for uh colorless. I just want to untap it all because it's annoying to look at. Oh uh, you have flyer shit. Okay. No, I'll just do one, two, three for a ghostly prison. Pay two for every creature that attacks me. Then I'm going to pay one, uh, two, three for Duelist Heritage. Whenever one or more creatures attacks and I have target attacking creature, gain double strike until end of turn. Um. Electra swings at me. Gunny Three, does four, that to, to uh, that is all I can give do double strike to all her shit to kill me. I almost guarantee it. One, two, three. Nah, there's no way I win this one. Six, nine. I have I'm nine. actually I'm super impressed that it did what it did. Escape tunnel. This and that was fucking cool. Smuggler's share, and then I pass the turn. Here we go. Oh yay. We. Wee. 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 I am like pleasantly surprised at how fun Gimbal is to play. I don't know. He looked like a little, a little ratty guy, but fun. 
I'm going to draw. This is a pretty cool deck. I definitely um, fucked up by juicing you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah but i didn't know hey but man you, you wouldn't know you, know, you wouldn't there's no, know there's no way to know until you know you know exactly you know you know oh good when it says target player can i target myself yes if you couldn't it'd say target opponent hmm. or unless you had shroud for whatever reason well it's something that has okay like the mana cost is x two and then blue and it's an instant. You'd have to pay a blue, two colorless, and then X extra. Okay, interesting. Um, all right, um, well, I'll play this and well, I'll, wait, do I sack it? Oh yeah, I sack it and then I'll just find the land. Is that Evolving Wilds? Yeah. All right. I could have done that because you tap this for blue. Okay. Players may spend mana um, as though it was mana of any color. Like I don't really want to play anything because if I play things then I can't use my little of my fun guys. Um, okay, wait, so Gunny, you have no blockers? I have no blockers, but if you want to attack me, it's going to cost two mana for every creature you send my way. Okay, and then Ben, how many blockers do you have? I have one, two, three. Okay. So, let me see. One second, I'm gonna be. <coughs> I gotta kill. If I could kill Electra, I I might be able to win. I can make I can make one thing unblockable. Basil Frost, it can only you can only block one creature at a time. She can kill you uh bolt with just lands though, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think okay, she Okay, I mean she I just, just win here, right? Yeah, you just swing out, dude. Unless unless okay. uh, Gunny has something in his hand right okay. now. You just swing out and that's that. Okay. So I would have to swing Wait, so do the you exact would... math. Yeah, because you would block I could block one, two, three things. And I will say, if you want to attack me, you gotta I have need to save the land. Pay, yeah. yeah, you have to pay two per two per creature that you send my way. Chad, he's got three open but mana, can, one red, wait. one white. He's got deflecting swat in okay, his hand. So say if I, I send like this up in okay i'm just doing like the four fours because it's going to confuse me any other way so if he okay. blocks this and he would block these i would need to do four eight twelve sixteen twenty and then i would have i could send and then you also send the phoenix at ben too yeah, you do have to send the phoenix at me. Oh, I have you to send to, yeah, this at you. So then good. I would. You could swap one one out. There you go. Swap that out. So then I could pay. Oh wait, this counts as a four four as well. So I would send that at you. So if I tap two, tap these two, I could send four at you. Wait, did I send this? No, I didn't. Wait, then I would um... send eight at you so this there's two 
for this guy, two for this guy, and then sending this. Actually, I think if you swing the Vidalkin at... Uh, well, never mind. The... Oh, wait, actually, yeah. yeah. When he attacks, if you control three or more attacks, creatures your opponents control lose all abilities and have base power and toughness of 1-1. One, one. Oh, and everything has trample. Artifact creatures you control have trample. So if I... I would swing this at Ben. So that all of his stuff becomes a 1-1. One, one. Okay. So even if he, like, blocks that... The his Laura is still going to be huge though because that and has a bunch Laura's of Laura's got equipments uh, and counters on it. I think but then the, the other things. Yeah, the, the other two become one ones. I believe. Yeah, this right? would be a one one. This would go down to a one one because they lose their abilities as well. Uh, mm -hmm. But she would you you would be knocking her from a three four down to a one one. But she'd still have all these counters and all the abilities. But still, she would only be able to block one thing that I send yes. at her, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so then I'd send this at her. Nothing would go through. If you would block with these two, there would still be six damage that goes through. Correct? Um, okay, so... Because they're both four fours. Those are both four fours. Um, they have trample. Yes, so that would be six. Yes. Yep. Six, so then this would be 10, 14, 18, so then you would die. Yep. If I send this at you. I don't... Th so I wouldn't even need to send this. And then that way I tap this, tap this, tap this. Then I can send four, eight. All right, would I do it a different way? Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you go do your thing, declare <laughs> attackers and make sure you're checking everything, okay? I, I, this is it, just one of those moments. It's you got, almost midnight. You got to get used to doing this. I'm so tired. I know you got to get used to doing this. Uh, it, this is an important piece of the game. So technically, then I would want to send these at Ben and not these two, right? Oh wait, no. The Phoenix still has to fucking Phoenix go to you. Phoenix has to come to me. <laughs> I'm so overwhelmed. Okay, <laughs> take it one thing at a time. So the Phoenix, let, set, put, put them in okay. two piles. The Phoenix is going to Ben. Yep, that one's going to me. Cool. Yeah. What is? <laughs> how much damage is that? Is that guy? Four. Okay. But this guy's also attacking. So when he's attacking, everything still becomes one one. All but my he's, and yes. he's three. So okay. So that's seven. Okay. So it's a four four. A three, four. This is a four, four. This is a four, four. But then I would probably want to send my two twos at you so I can do the most damage to Gunny. Correct? Yep. <clears throat> probably. But in what order? Like, was obviously you can pick what you block yeah. with Laura. So you're going to be blocking a four, four because then you'd get the most out of it, right? Yeah, well, I'll, I'll block whatever your most damage is. Okay, so it would be three, seven, nine, 11, 15. And then 19. Okay, and so now that this is what you're sending to me. This all would kill you, okay. yes. What and then in order to the attack him, I have to tap to send Gimbal, so that's four. I need to tap to and send another four, that's eight. And then I tap to, and then this one's 12. But then I would, so he still would have HP. So he'd have two HP but then I still have these as blockers for force. Uh, I'm just gonna do this now because I don't know how this is gonna work. This is, this is my combat trick. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna flash in Selfless Squire. 
Uh, prevent all damage that be dealt to me this turn. Yep. And then he, he gains, uh, that, that made plus one, plus one counters. So he gains 12. Dang. But how does this work with the Vidalkin Humiliator? Because... Uh, oh, okay. true. So... Because when he attacks, does it check for the board state at that point? And then uh, since this is coming in after that check, okay. is, he, is he not affected by the loss of abilities? Looking. Vidalkin Humiliator. I think I did the uh, math. Vidalkin wrong. Humiliator's abilities ability affects only creatures your opponents control at the time it resolves. Creatures they begin to control later in the turn won't lose power, toughness, or abilities. Okay. So Can yes, I so got it. What, what's up, Electric? Well, I realized I did it wrong because then I sent 18 at you, but then I had two two twos in here. So technically, I could tap this, add the two onto the 12, and kill him. Correct. Yeah, uh, it's okay, so... But that would be me taking an oopsie because I didn't realize that with yeah, the math. Yeah, see, ultimately he's gonna... So if, if you did that, yes. Um, is that what you would, ha would have done to do it optimally? Because that's I mean, gonna yeah. give that's gonna give his but... guy two more 1-1 one, one counters. Because he's stopping the, the combat damage that you're doing to him. Oh, so no matter what I do, yeah. I can't kill him because exactly because he flashed he flashed in selfless squire, um, so oh, okay. I would just sure, keep sure it how you know. had it. So okay, okay. I didn't I didn't know that that's yeah. Okay. I was just asking if yep. I was to do it the other way, if it would have mattered. Okay, you're good. Okay, so you're done clearing attackers. Gunny took the twelve, uh, and then how much are you hitting me for? Can you recount it? Um, I'm sending a four four at you. Okay, I I would kill that one. Okay, so then it would be um, four, eight, 12. Um, wait, am I dumb? Don't answer that. Four, eight, Is the guy 12. underneath that four, four? Is he a four, four as well? This one's a... No, wait, underneath the four, the, the token at the top. That beast, what's underneath the beast? This one's a two, two. Okay, so... Oh, wait, hold on. Or what, was he These out when that? These two have flying. Okay, those two have flying. So I'm gonna take. I take six no matter You're what. You're gonna take six no matter what. Okay. You're blocking a four four. Blocking a four four. Okay. And, and then, then you would take five. This is five. But all of them, all of your stuff has one yeah, one, all one and everything yep. has trample. So then that would I, be... That's why I want to know the, the math. 5, 9, 13. 13. So it'd be 19, right? I, 13 okay, so plus... I already subtracted six. this. Yeah, so 19 total. Uh, and I was yeah. at 17, correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm going to tap, uh, in response, I'm going to tap Duretti and this other artifact I have. Uh, for two mana, I can use of any color, and I'm going to tap uh, Grim Whisper. This one was still up. I just flipped it anyway. Uh, to gain three life. One, two, three. I'm going to block. You kill the Construct. I'm going to block. You kill Urza. Uh, and then I take 13 damage. Oh, I missed the trigger. I just realized. Uh, the Duelist Heritage, but... What's the duelist? Uh, oh yeah, you did. You did, but it's too late uh, now. <laughs> yep. Yep. Too late now. Otherwise, I'd be fucking dead. <laughs> yep. And then um, I lost one, two things to the graveyard. You lost a thing to the graveyard. So I go up. This goes up. So plus four, plus four. Oh, how many creatures were attacking, by the way? <clears throat> was electric. it more than 10? Four, I don't know, five, I'm six, seven, eight, nine. It was 10 on the dot. Uh, then you. before combat ends, I'm going to flash in Ancient Stone Idol for free. 
He costs one less for each attacking creature. Oh. Yeah, he's free. Fuck. Okay, cool. Anything else, Electra? I don't know. I'm too fucking tired right now. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> it's okay. I we, don't want to do math right now. Both, I want to go to sleep. I'm, I'm, I'm helping you out. We both had responses. That's why I wanted you to yeah. count up the exact amount of damage to show that, like, there's still chances for people to do shit. Well, which ones did you block? So I, I blocked and killed the Phoenix. And then it doesn't really matter what else I block because I had two one ones. You just kill well, them. But you can pick. Oh, I just killed them, so it doesn't yeah, matter. Yeah, they're 1-1s. One they, don't, they, they don't have de uh, death touch because I'm not attacking. So it doesn't matter. You, you just stomp them. Okay. Done? Yeah. That kind of trample and everything? Yep. Damn. Yeah, because I missed the trigger to give one of he was gonna, uh, Electra's he was gonna, creatures I, was, I even told chat. I even told chat. Gunny's going to give double strike to one of uh, Electra's things and kill me. Yeah, uh, I was not going to fucking say anything, that's for sure. Yeah, no, you, you were right not to. Alright, um, untap. Oh, that's still an exile. Uh, upkeep, let's see here. Uh, beginning of your upkeep, put a time counter on as foretold. Once each turn, I can pay zero rather than have to pay mana cost one for one spell. Um, at the beginning of your upkeep, surveil one. I will surveil. It is going to go into the graveyard. Um, then if you have seven or more permanents, it transforms. Go ahead and do that. Boop. Um, and then speaking of your upkeep, uh, if an opponent controls three or more creatures, sack Defense of the Heart and get two creatures from my library out onto the battlefield. Okay, Tyrant, it's only the beginning of your upkeep do I win, so it's not yet. Uh, we'll do fucking Chisgoria. There, my hand size is currently fuck all. Here, uh, tr uh, I have two draws coming up in a second. Did all those, did those, did those. Did all the beginning of turn stuff. Okay, uh, going to draw now. I draw two. Gunny, I think you get some, right? Yep. Uh, okay, I will do a. I'll put that forest down. Um, I'm gonna tap fucking this for one to play a uh, Totex Spear, which is gonna be automatically equipped at Shadow Spear. Uh, to. Oh, that's my commander. Um, oh, actually, we'll do. Before I play this, I'll use that one. Uh, I'll tap this guy for two, tap this guy for three, and move the Shroud temporarily to. Uh, Hellkite Tyrant. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. And then I'll do one uh, to put uh, that on there. And then I'll do uh, fucking one, two, fucking three to move the Shroud and Unblockable back to Ms. Lara Croft. Um let's see here where do we want to go next sack an artifact is there anything out here that I want to get back out actually yeah there kind of is um, I'm going to do his middle power go down to one I'm going to sack chromatic lantern to put uh, Urza Lord High Artificer back out on the battlefield He's going to get his construct back, which is going to be fucking fat. 
Um, so fat. It's hella fat, dude. I'm not. It's wild how fat that thing is. Um, oh, I was fucked up there. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. I was doing shit that I shouldn't have been able to do. I'm good now. This is tapped, and my artifacts are now not tapped because Urza wasn't fucking on the battlefield. I couldn't have tapped the uh, artifacts for mana. Now we're good. Okay. Uh, constructs out. Flying haste, affinity. Don't have to worry about that. I do have a way to give that haste right now. That'd be fucking dope. Uh, it's tapped. Sorry. No, I, I mean, I, I would probably kill you with it. Uh, <laughs> make sure I'm not fucking missing anything. Let's see here. Okay, what is she at right now? Six, uh, 12, 16, um, 17, 18. 1920 and Electra you have two blockers right now oh wait unblockable yeah um, I'm gonna go to combat mm -hmm. I'm gonna swing uh, Chiscoria at you gunny in the air you don't have any flyers do you uh, nope and nothing with reach <clears throat> okay. uh, it is a 5-4 uh, and then Electra, I'm gonna kill you with uh, Lara Croft. Nice, GG. What a way to go. Um, and then if there's any way to go and be by her, you know. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm gonna go to my. Ooh, uh, I, I think I've done. Oh, uh, just Gorya trigger. Sorry. Uh, whenever it attacks, exile the top five cards of your graveyard. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, you may cast an artifact spell from among them this turn. Uh, if you do, it has affinity for artifacts. Uh, I mean, I'm going to play Andurial Flame of the West. It's going to come out for free anyway. Um, and then I'll stick it on fucking... I'll stick it on a Hellkite Tyrant. I need to create two of those tokens that are tapped. Oh, uh, yeah, fuck it. We'll put it on Hellkite Tyrant. Um, and then these guys are in exile, correct? If you do, it has many artifacts. Yes. Okay. Um, I guess while I'm at it, I might as well tap fucking two. Boom, boom, and cast Bloom Tender. Get him out just to gas the numbers up. Good fucking god, this deck went crazy. Um, that's that trigger. I'm gonna go to my end step. Um, I have two things. I've got discover five that I have to do. God, this is so fucking hard to track. I'm sorry. Uh, do you want to order it to where the Palantin goes off first and you can describe? Oh, yes, 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 yes. That was the thing. I, I forgot Palantir is the other thing that goes off. So I'll we'll do Palantir first. It's going to go to two. Uh, I'm going to scry two. Um, okay. Those will go. Actually, we'll do. I'm going to put both of those at the bottom. Oh, okay. Okay. And then uh, I'm going to pick Gunny because you're the only one left. Uh, would you like me to mill cards or draw cards? I'm going to gamble it. Fucking mill that shit. I'm going to mill two. You're going to take nothing and one. Nice. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Good shit. You could have died. That would have been fucking crazy. There's some big ass expensive cards in here too. Um, and then <laughs> I will. Oh, discover five. Oh, GG's Electra, by the way, if you're still here. Um, You're still here, Electra. GG's, GG's. I'm super tired, so I'm gonna go to bed. Nice Thanks for playing. You. Yeah, GG's, you guys. Yes. Bye. Um, that's gonna go there, and then I'm gonna pass my turn to you, Gunny. Can you kill me? All right. I believe I can. Yes. All right. Uh, all right. So untap. Upkeep. I draw. Um. Okay. I will first start by playing a Temple of Triumph. Scry, doesn't matter if you tap top. 
Uh, first things first, I will tap one red, two colorless. I'm gonna cast shiny impetus. Oh, I forgot um, something. Mm. Um, equip creature gets plus one plus one has trample and life link. I forgot. Laura has life link. Oh, so you you probably have like way much more life than than you thought possible right now. And from your thing, 23, 24, so I have 25 hit points. All right. Sorry, I completely no forgot worries. that, my bad. No worries. Uh, okay, so I'm going to... I just have to that. go, I have to go all in here. Um, yeah. So I am going to cast Shiny Impetus. I'm gonna put that on uh, one... None of your things have trample on them, right? Just flying and uh, stuff like that. Uh, she has trample, but she can't attack you. Yeah, but she can still block, which is the annoying thing. Um, oh, does Va does Vow Duty let you block still? Oh yeah, uh, yeah you can still block. Oh no, can't. Yeah, can't attack me or planeswalkers. I control. You can still. Yeah, you can still block. Yep. Um. So yeah, this will go. Since I can't target Laura, this will go on. Um. One of your flyers. Uh, Chiscoria or Hellkite Tyrant? Uh, Hellkite Tyrant. Uh, what is it? Uh, plus two, plus two, whenever this creature attacks. Uh, and it's plus two, plus two, goaded. What's and, the name of the card? Uh, Shiny Impetus. Okay. Uh, plus two, plus two, and is goaded whenever it attacks. Oh, yeah, it makes creature token. So that means it will have to attack you, by the way. Yes, I know. Okay. Um,. I mean, the, the, basically, if you don't kill me right now, you're dead anyway, unless you yeah, have, like, yeah. a, it's something crazy. This is, this is my all-in plan right now. So, um, I'll then tap for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to play Havoc Eater, targeting uh, the other flyer you have, Just Yeah, you yep, what does so, Havoc Eater do? Uh, he gets, uh, he goads one target uh, per opponent, and then he gains uh, and then, uh, plus one plus one counters equal to the power of each goaded creature. Gotcha. So he gets five counters on him. Yep. Now, um, I go I go to combat. <clears throat> yes. Hot Pursuit's now gonna trigger. Hot Pursuit says, at the beginning of combat on my turn, if two or more players have lost the game, gain control of all goaded and or suspected creatures until end of turn. Untap mm -hmm. them and they gain haste. Correct. So now you have Chiscoria and uh, Hellkite Tyrant. Yes. Um, cool. <clears throat> okay. And then I am... I just have to swing out with everything. So Chiscoria, Hellkite, 12-12 uh, that, and a 13-13 this. Unless your stuff has trample on it, um... Nothing is trample, so. Okay. Um, so the Helkai Tyrant is flying and trample. Uh, it is a 9-6, and I am going to take that 9. Um, your, what's your 12-12? Uh, it's just a 12-12 flash, and when it dies, it makes a 6-12. Okay, my contract is at least a 30-30, based on what you see on the board. It's all artifacts, so I'm going to block and yep. kill that. So yep. the contract okay. kills that guy. Um, yep. you, what else is on, uh, so I'm, I'm taking uh, the 13, nine 13. Here. Okay. Um, oh, you... um, I, I, I guess I would, I would, I would have given the, the one with trample double strike, but, um, uh, the Hellkai Tyrant. Yeah. That is fine. Um, yeah. so instead of nine, it would be 18. Perfect. We'll keep that there yep. for now. Okay. Yep. Um, you control those guys. I am going to, so I blocked one. What do I, I still have, uh, Chiscoria coming. You actually have an attack trigger you need to do. Um, uh, exile the top, exile five, the top cards. five cards and cast, you can cast an artifact spell from among them. Uh, if you do, it has affinity for artifacts. So you basically pick a, pick a spell and it's probably free. Uh... Let's see. Um, that's worthless. 
If something is overload, can I cast the overload cost for free? Nope. Nope. Oh, wait. Chat, can you? Maybe you can. She didn't, War Dog, she didn't get it until the end of combat. Um, you actually, can you, Chat, can you affinity and overload? Um, I'm Googling. I don't think you can. Oh, you can't. It's an alternate cost. Alternate okay, cool. Cost. So okay. You cannot cast the overload. Um, then the only thing that, because I'll just show you how I have. Well, you have to show me anyway. They're exiled. Yeah. Uh, Frontier, Warmonger, Land, Land, Come Up, as would have been great to have. Um, but. And then Spectacular Showdown. So that's the only one I can really cast. Okay. So Sorcery says put a double strike counter on target creature. Yep. Then go to each creature that had a double strike counter from this way. Sadly, this is during combat, so I can't do the hot pursuit. Um, I mean, it would just have to be... It just have to be the... Um, the Squire then. Because... Uh, no, uh, I'll put the double strike counter on... Chiscoria. Okay. So, That's yeah, he'd be a 10 four then. Yep. No trample. Okay. Um, okay, good. Then, uh, what? so minus Chiscoria, what do you still have that's attacking that I haven't blocked? Just that 12, the, that guy? 13, 13, yes. 13, 13. Okay. He does not have trample, so. All right, cool. Um, Bloom Tender will block that and die. Um, and then I will have Lara block Chiscoria and kill it. Um, yep. and, then and then I you'll gain, go up another like 27 life. life. Yeah. Are you done with your and turn? Then, yeah. That's all I got. I would get a 612 at the end of combat. And then it goes to my yeah. upkeep and I win because of Hellkite Tyrant. Yep. Holy fuck. Damn. <laughs> it did a thing. This deck is uh, fucking wild. That was, that, that was a game, dude. Yeah, that was shit. a crazy game. That, that had lots of shit going on. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, this deck played way better than I thought it would. Like le uh, miles better. I kind of I I kind of want to see. Uh, Mar I gotta tell Amy uh, Markov against this deck. I think I I don't know how this uh, this did this did a whole ton of shit. Yeah. Like this was fucking ridiculous. So. It, it, is it like a Voltron where you're just trying to put as much shit as possible on? Well, it didn't. I didn't plan it that way, but yeah, that's kind of how it ended up. There aren't enough creatures in the deck. Very clearly, any time if I go up against a deck that has fucking sacrifice, I'm getting smoked because Lara's just gonna yeah, get my, taken off the board over and over again. Um, my and vampire deck would. Urza was a big fucking piece of this. So, so get Urza and getting Myco uh, Mycosynth Lattice. That was the yeah. whole my whole plan anyway, and I got enough tutor going because of Duretti that I could get the shit out that I needed and then start churning away. And that was wild. That was you really have, cool. Um, do you have Psych Rift in there? Um, there? There should be, but I don't have one. So there is no Cyclonic Rift. Okay. Um, so yeah, Psych Rift would be good. Um, the deck list is up a... on uh, on my Moxfield. If you want to go look at it later. Um, oh, it... Um, actually, I think I have a card that would interest you because um, it's all about artifacts and it's blue. It came out in the um, in the newest Markov set. It's blue and two colorless, and whenever you cast an artifact, you investigate, and then it reduces the activation cost of any artifact ability by one. But it can't go below uh, zero. Yes, that one, that one. Yeah, it's in the deck already. Oh, it is? Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. As um, soon as I saw that, I was like, that's got to go in there. Yeah, no, I mean, that was a game. <laughs> that was cool. Hey, GG's, man. GG's. I'm going to hell to bed. I'm tired. Yeah, same. Have a good night. See you, bud. Ooh. Doom, doom. That was, uh... I whipped this shit up tonight. Every single one of these cards that I played tonight. So I'm going to update the deck list um, and swap stuff around so you can see what's actually in it. 
because uh, what's on there right now is not all the way accurate. Um, but this did stuff. This did a lot of crazy shit. Um, it's it's not twelve hundred dollars or whatever that is. Um, just keep that in mind. That was about half the the fucking my library played right there. That was psycho, dude. That was so cool. I I'm pretty proud of myself. That I built some stupid bullshit. <laughs> oh fuck. All right. Uh, y'all enjoy your night tomorrow. Um, oh, oh, chat tomorrow. Listen, in the morning. Me. Darkness four two nine. Tim. Rexzilla and Mugs are going back to COD for a little bit. This is a Warhammer 40k shit, dude. So just keep that in mind. Um, yeah, it's uh, tomorrow's going to be really interesting. I'm excited. I'm very excited. Uh, so if you're around, jump on in the morning. Um, we'll be here, you know, doing the thing. And then um, probably after, uh, once that's done, I'll probably be back on Tarkov uh, doing, you know, running around with buds and all that. So uh, it should be good. Enjoy your night. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, Insulin Warrior 5. My uncle named his dogs Timex and Rolex. There's watchdogs. Rachel the 5 said, How do you make fruit punch? Give them boxing gloves. I don't. I don't. I don't like you guys. We'll talk about charity stuff tomorrow morning when more people are around. Okay, bye. Let me back it up to the start of the climb. Faced with an army of vipers and lions. I had to keep on reaching up because it was my time to tear down the kingdom and call out the lions. Got a jail on my heart from the pessimist. Got those nails. Every single day I feel that gold underneath I see the light